Hey, right. what's up, guys? Are right, you flaky fudgesicles? Welcome back to Radiant Dawn. I know, Z I know, Z I know Zappy is excited. Uh, Jacob, can you change my controllers, please? Oh yeah, right. You, you you're still using my Mario Kart controls. That's right. I was testing out some uh, MK Wii yesterday. There we go. Mario Kart Wii is really weird. Yeah, but well, that's why I love it. <laughs> I just don't care about Mario Kart Wii anymore. I'm sorry. Mm, I had my I had my phase. <laughs> You, my, you ma always... my, ma my Mario Kart phase kind of comes and goes. You always have a phase. Yeah, just like I had a Mario Kart 8 phase, and now I don't care about Mario Kart 8. Mario Kart 8 was never that good, I'll tell you that. <laughs> good thing Ike isn't a transfer bonus. Who said that? Zeppi said that. Who else? <laughs> I wonder why. Because it was you. You? I don't you? know! <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> oh yeah, and I added the sound effect that you wanted me to add. What? No! <laughs> no! <laughs> <laughs> I- You know, Jacob, I am not ready for this chapter at all. I mean, this is- we got like- we got like badass preparation music. Yeah, we do. Sounds like um, it sounds like a Dark Souls boss is about to show up. It does. I am not gonna level up Makai until she gets speed. Remember Meme of Light, a new world light mod released called Animation of Light. What is that? Maiden, please take this, dude. You are the commander general of Dane Army. It's imperative that you lead our troops from this spot. However, with this tome, you can aid your allies from afar. Thank you. Oh yeah, you get Purge. That's right. Oh, I got a distant weapon. That's really cool. World of Light with cartoon and anime characters as spirits. You're not gonna force me to play that. I, I don't care. Who's telling you about this? Ah, uh, one of my chat members. Okay. Maybe I'll make that new a newest incentive. Make me play animation of light. You know what, how about- how about you do this for one million bits? That's a lot of bits. I'll make that- yeah, I'll, I'll make that my 1,000 bit goal, how about that? <laughs> how about- you know what, how about 3,000? Mmm... How about 1,000 to play World of Light, or to play Meme of Light again? And 3,000 to play anime- or no. You, you know what I mean, right? 3,000 to replay Beam of Light and 1,000 to do Animation of Light. How about 1,500? Nah, I already have it. I already have 1,000 bits set. You know what? Sure. I don't care. We need like 400 more bits for the 1,000 bit incentive, so yeah. You know what? Fine. <laughs> General Toronto, hello. I hope this battle goes well for you. Oh, <laughs> Good to see that you remain strong. While I had to defeat Sonic again. <laughs> and show up in the third movie. <laughs> oh, Jill, stand fast, but not like the hedgehog. In the face of adversary. Hello, I hope you, you're enjoying yourself as much as my little... Bastille or something? Beastie. <laughs> Beastie? Yeah. Oh, he just, she just means her pet wyvern. Yeah. And, uh, IR. What is transfer bonus? Well, basically, transfer bonus is where you transfer, transfer, you know, the bonuses from your older game to transfer to the new one. Mm, what did get transferred over? Uh, bonus stats. Really? I didn't notice. Yeah, neither do I. That's literally what I just said. <laughs> if your if your stats are maxed out specifically, uh you uh you get plus two stats. Hmm. Well I guess we'll see if any of that actually applied. <laughs> because we have yeah. a complete we have a complete save file of Path of Radiance on this uh, emulator. So well, we did. I don't know. <laughs> you know, Jacob, I'm just going to say this once. 
What? Literally the best character in in the mid gate is probably Lara. What about Nolan? Isn't he also good? I haven't even developed him that much. Oh well, Laura definitely he she's maxed out a lot of her stats. Oh, she did. Oh, here comes funny, funny Lagoos. Yeah, there's gonna be a ton of Lagoos in this. Isn't that fun? Just like in the kitchen. <laughs> Stirring the macaroni. Oh yeah, you wanna know what movie I wanna rewatch? <laughs> what? I wanna rewatch the B movie. <laughs> That's understandable. Because it has Jerry Seinfeld as the B. Yeah, and it has Patrick Warburton in it as well. Oh, <laughs> uh, okay. You know, the voice of Joe Swanson. <laughs> yeah. Man of Dawn, please remain here! Alright. So I can't leave. <laughs> I can't leave. Oh, so I was gonna... So I guess Micaiah's mid Kaya is just stuck up there. You know, that's really depressing, I will say that. It's pretty... it's pretty mid. If Ike from Path of Radiance was transferred here, Ike would have been a big threat. Yeah, he would have had all the... he... Like, didn't he have, like, plus... Didn't he have, like, 35 strength or something? At the end of the game? No, he had, like, 24 strength. He had a lot, I know that. <laughs> he maxed that out oh, pretty yeah, much. Oh, yeah, I remember, it's 27. There you go. So, what, he would have had 29 strength, then? I don't think so. <laughs> okay, now that's better. <laughs> yeah. I didn't even notice, but yeah, the fucking um, the devoted is playing. <laughs> you know, that's actually a better choice for a song. It's not supposed to be playing the devoted, guys. I um, I, I added that myself. If in case you didn't know. I know. Oh shit, I know, I, but... shit, I forgot to add the warp staff. Damn it. Let me write that down. I'll add it next time. We'll have it for part four. You know, I'm just really happy that you added <laughs> stuff like this. <laughs> so happy. And that kitty's dead. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Oh, weird. What a weird noise for a kitty to be making. Oh, I'm sure that's odd, alright. It's a real odyssey. Odyssey. Oh. Wait, what? <laughs> the music broke. Are you gonna fix that? Um. I have not tested it. <laughs> Jacob. What? Why? I didn't know. I didn't know it was gonna break. And you have also not tested. And you have also not tested out the freaking level up theme. Well, I don't know where that is in the files. Well, at least try to find it later. Yeah, and maybe I'll have to figure out why the battle music broke. Well, at least it's playing back, the battle music. <laughs> at, le at least it's back for now. At least it's better. Even with the broken music, at least it's better than... Sure, than the okay. battle theme for... For the mid For the mid-gade. Yeah, it's still better. I, I don't know why it breaks, though. That's be That's, uh... Yes. I'm confused about that. Just try to fix it later, since we are going to do two chapters anyways. Yeah. BRSTMs are weird, guys. <laughs> like, BRSTMs, they have to be done in, like, a very specific way, or else, um... It just doesn't work. It just doesn't work for some reason. Yeah. Like, literally all I did was I just copied, I copied the, the Devoted BRSTM, renamed it to the, the song of the, like, bat, Dawn Brigade battle theme, and that's all I did. But, clearly that doesn't work. 
Yeah, I know that. It might be it might, it might be a case where the song has to be um, the same length, or else it doesn't work. That could be possible because so I know it's weird. Like some games, some games let you let you go over the limit, and some games don't. It's very weird. Yeah, I know that. But well, at least the music for this one isn't broken. Uh, isn't broken. Yeah, that I, that, that that's, that's unchanged. And I'm kind of glad I didn't because then that song would be broken too. Yeah. You know, Jacob, everything that I'm doing right now, I'm not gonna fast forward. Damn, okay, South. Yeah, you're still not better than Heather. <laughs> he's, uh, he's Diet Heather. <laughs> yes, he's Diet Heather. I mean, honestly, Jacob, you should have gotten enough more time to do this kind of shit. What, to do the BRSTMs? Yeah. That would mean I'd have to play the game and actually test it out. <laughs> I know. But still, though, you would have gotten enough time. It's kind of hard to do. test something like that. I but know. I'll, I'll, I'll figure it out next time if um, the Dawn mid-game music still plays. Uh, you guys are all transforming. <laughs> Look at that, we're I'm only on, on turn three. Yeah, I am not in a good position. Literally, I am effed. At least you have purge. Yeah, but the purge is not gonna last long. Didn't even kill, bro, what the hell? <laughs> the kitty is coughing. You get to hear the Devoted for, like, two battles, and then it just stops. <laughs> it's probably- it's pro it probably is a side effect of how, like, damn short the Dawn Brigade battle theme is. Maybe? I don't know. I'll look at it later, though. Yeah, I think it's best to look at it later on. Yeah, and see just why it breaks. Because if it turns out that it's one of those BRSTMs that you can't have it be over a certain length, that might be why. It's just really dumb that it has to be limited. Yeah, that's why I hate BRSTMs. Because sometimes they have, like, arbitrary limits. Well, what about Smash Bros? As far as I know, Brawl doesn't have any limits on its BRSTMs. Nor does Mario Kart Wii. So, these are one of the cases where the songs are actually manageable enough? Yeah. Well, for example, Mario Kart Wii has some BRSTMs that can't be over a certain length. Like, for example, the title screen music. If it's over, like, 40 seconds, it just breaks. That's It's, it's weird. And that goes for any sound effects in the game, too. If the sound effects are longer than the source, it just breaks. <laughs> it also can't be a bigger file size, either. If the file size is bigger, it also breaks. So you either have to make it smaller, or shorter. <laughs> okay, that crit was necessary. <laughs> Plus, it looks cool. It does. He's not gonna get Bane, I will tell you that. <laughs> it's no Bane, but I'll take it. Anyways, guys, I finally got NES World Championships to work today. You'll ne the, the amount of hoops... Also, that was a good crit. The amount of hoops I had to go through to get that shit to work, though, was annoying. Because I tried it on Yuzu, and... Yeah, how did that go? Uh, it went terribly. The game went fucking boo, because it kept thinking I had the wrong prod keys. And I was like, well, wh what the fuck? I thought I installed eight, the 18.0 prod keys. I did, I did that, the game still wouldn't fucking boot, even though I installed new firmware. So, me installing the 18.0 firmware was a waste of time, because it didn't work on Yuzu. So then I tried on Ryujinx, because like, well I still have Ryujinx, and I have not updated Ryujinx in so long, because I barely use it. 
just because it's too demanding on my my graphics card. <laughs> I know. You so, don't even like Ryu. You don't like Ryu, Jinx, right? Well, I would like it more if it just wasn't so straining on my graphics card. It uses, it uses like 40% of it. It's kind of a lot. The thing I like about Dolphin and Yuzu is that they only use like 20 to 30% most of the time. If I had a better graphics card, like, I don't so know. That's why they are... Well, what about PS2 or uh, PS3? Well, here's the thing. Could it handle your PC well? PS2 is perfectly fine. PS3 it uses about 50%, which is a lot. But for a game like Neptunia, I don't mind much because I'm using half my graphics card on the emulator. I'm using the other half for recording. So basically most of my graphics card is just being used up. And I don't mind because nobody's on my computer. But when someone joins my computer, uh, you can see Parsec. Um, yeah. Parsec itself uses like half my graphics card. So That's bad, isn't it? Yeah, it's bad. So Parsec uses half my graphics card. A PS3 emulator would use half my graphics card, and recording with OBS would use half of it. So basically what that means right? so basically it would exceed a hundred percent. And basically what that means is it would have to split the CP it would have to split the GPU usage into like thirty percent chunks. Which means it might not reach the full performance that it needs. <laughs> So that's why you might that's why you might see a bit of lag. <laughs> Ryujink sucks because Kokchan broke it. Oh yeah, that's right. Fucking engage. Straight up doesn't run properly on Ryujinx. It crashes a bunch and the cutscenes don't work. Why not? I don't know, I can know. That's just it's just Ryujinx being stupid. <laughs> he doesn't fucking play FA Engage. So we had to switch I had to download Yuzu that day. And then I ran, I ran, I ran, um, Engage on Yuzu, and it worked just fine. I was able to watch the cutscenes, and so me and Zeppi just played it on that the whole time. Oh, that's good. Yeah. That's at least good. Yeah, and that's why I just kind of stuck with Yuzu for a while, because one, it's less demanding on my computer, and two, it seems to run games more faithfully. But there are the rare cases where Ryujinx plays something better. I mean, Zach's even told me that. But... Like what? Like, um, Smash Ultimate, I think, runs better on Ryujinx, depending on how good your graphics card is. I tested it on Yuzu, and I think it runs better on there. I can't think of any games that come to mind that run better on Ryujinx, but so far, the only game that I'm playing on Ryujinx right now is the NES World Championships, because I couldn't figure out how to get it to run on Yuzu, because Yuzu doesn't get support anymore. So, yeah, so trying to get brand new games to run on Yuzu is a bitch. <laughs> You can, could imagine you, can, you can run all the old games on it, like 2022 and like before, but anything like really brand new that came out this year probably won't run on Yuzu. Unless you have like... some Unless someone like updates the firmware or something properly. Yeah, I got the NES World Championship, so... If anybody wants to play that, hit me up. I have it. <laughs> okay, sure. I was planning on getting everybody together to play it on... Friday, if it, I, 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 I have to see who'd want to play it though. So who are you gonna invite? Of I don't people care. that you know. I don't care. I'll invite anybody because it, it supports up to eight players. <laughs> yeah, you just need eight people. I mean, I don't need eight people, but hey, the more the better. Yeah, the more the better, you and the girl, more the merrier. The girl leveled up. Yeah, at least she level up a good stat, which is something that I'm happy to see. I so wish she levels up more strength. There's still a few more people I need to get, um, like on the Parsec. Some people, some of my friends still don't have Parsec yet because I've been trying to get them on it for ages, and they just said like, "Oh, I'm not free," or "Oh, I don't have a computer," and shit like that. At least cuts cut them some tack because some of the some some people don't even have computers. Yeah, <laughs> those people. The, pe the, the people that don't have computers, I'm less likely to play with because I just can't. What what can I play with them? I literally, well, look, I I literally didn't even have a computer for years. Yeah. But now, now I literally now have one do. because I literally have one because I just save enough money to beg for one. <laughs> Doing the Funi Dream speedrun is not worth it. 
Yeah, I'd imagine why. Holy shit, he just maxed out skill. Holy shit. Yeah, I know. That's crazy. <laughs> Holy shit. Mm, yeah, crazy. Crazy taxi. Yeah, because because me and the boys are planning to play Paper Jam tomorrow. And then I'm also going to try and finish up Amazing Mirror tomorrow. I wonder how that will go. Uh, it should be good. We just have to defeat one more world and then do the final boss. It's pretty quick. Because we made a lot of progress in Part 2 of Amazing Mirror. We did like four or five worlds, <laughs> which is a lot. Warriors critting is the greatest thing. Why? Because they have a shit hit rate? <laughs> No, or, it's or because it's satisfying. That, no, it's because that I'm I'm sure you've seen Nolan's crit anim crit animation where he literally spins around the axe and just throws it. I mean that is cool though. <laughs> it is. Like seeing a seeing an axe freaking spin, that's awesome. <laughs> it is pretty cool. Good job, Jill. You almost killed the tiger. I don't think Jill's gonna last this long. <laughs> Bonks you in the head? Yeah, you horny. Bonk you for being horny. Oh, well, that's lucky! <laughs> lucky? Lucky! Literally missed by an 84% chance. That is good RNG. Also, that guy barely lived. <laughs> Ninety-three. Oh, but the kitty only does four damage. Well, at least I land a damage. Jeez, these are that's a lot of reinforcements. <laughs> Oops, all the goes. Well, at least I can I can kill one of them. This has gotta be like the like the lamest defense chapter of all time. It's just like oh, it only Lagoo's units, and Makaya can't even leave her zone. Her zenless zone zero. Jeez. She can't even leave Fuck that. you, Makaya, you useless bitch! <laughs> Why can't you level up speed? I'm a oh. Where is my bitch sound? <laughs> bitch. There we go. <laughs> Can I load a save state? Sure. You know, this makes me freaking angry that I can't even level her up with speed. Because I'm sure, I'm sure, God forbid, that she level, she can level up speed. <laughs> I'm actually Todd Howard now. Nope. Makaya, sometimes I want to strangle you so hard that you level up speed. <laughs> <laughs> Just blackmail her. Makaya, if you don't level up speed, I'm gonna kill your entire army. <laughs> yeah, just like Al Pacino would. You know, maybe Makaya should sign a blood pact, except the blood pact only says you have to level up speed. <laughs> you know what? That's that's a good trade-off. I, I like that trade-off. <laughs> Hell yeah. Well, at least I have physic. Yep. But I can't waste too much on it since. You can fail level amp speed, but you can't fail physics. Yeah. Yeah, I know. Even though I hated physics. Physics are really good. <laughs> well, I like I like the jiggle variety. Well, I know. <laughs> You better level up speed. Come on. Think. Nope. <laughs> she maxed out defense. <laughs> but her defenses are really fragile. Yeah. Jose getting at slow Kai is the equivalent of me getting over missing the attacks. Oh yeah, that was also funny. <laughs> Zeppi just getting salty over like a twenty percent uh, miss rate or whatever. That tiger is dead. He's got the eye of the tiger. That's a good. That's a good one, Jacob. That's <laughs> really a good 
one. <laughs> I can't tell if that's sarcasm or not. No, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not even sarcastic. That's actually a good joke. Oh, okay. <laughs> I like that song. Engage everybody bullshit. Loves well, everybody loves that song. Well, maybe you should engage the enemy. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> the the mu the music had to pause because like, bro, that was a terrible joke. <laughs> I know. It's, Jacob, it's, it's hilarious how abrupt the music stops. You know, Jacob, one of these days you really should help me uh, figure out the music for, for these kind of things because I'm because I really wanted well because like I said yesterday, I just I just want to change the music for Brawl. Well, one of these days you should download Brawl Crate. <laughs> I know because I already have downloaded Brawl Crate. Oh, you did? did yeah. You, did you open it? Yeah. Um, did you extract your disc for Brawl? Not yet. Okay, that'd be the next step then. Well, what do you mean extract? Extract all the files from the game with Dolphin. Okay. I'm sure it's not the last step. Hmm, well, you also gotta get Audacity, so you should probably download that tonight. Yeah, I know. I just need to remember all of this because I'm terrible at remembering. <laughs> the fucking music stopping. <laughs> Don't use Makaya. Oh, trust me, I won't use fucking Slow Kaya. <laughs> slow Kaya. Because she's fucking slow. I'm she's fucking invincible. She's a bitch and she's slow. AF. I mean, look no. at Nolan. He level up speed. He <laughs> and his tomahawk broke. Well, at least he has his personal weapon that will give that will give a boost of defense. Wow. So he's got twenty defense. He has more defense than Mikhail already. Yeah, that's literally the most depressing thing about Mikhail. She can't even get defense. But if she can level up speed, I would be happy. <laughs> Wait, what? Did you just... She didn't level oh. up from that. Well, okay. I'll just deal with it. <laughs> just deal with it. Get with it, bro. Ooh. Zeppi sent me good sauce. Hold on. Let me look at that. No, not the, not the Jose and Zeppi group DM. Fuck. And my disc my di my Discord is being a bitch. It's lagging. Well, what are what are you doing? I'm trying to show um some sauce. Okay. Check check this shit out, guys. What is? It's, oh. It's Coke Chan Booba. I think he sent me this. Did he send you that? I think so. Yeah, Wait, what did that say on the chat? <laughs> he said, calm down, Jose, it's okay. <laughs> I know. I just want Mikaya to be fast, so I don't want slow Kaya. You're too slow. Thank you, Sonic. <laughs> <laughs> well, at least I'll get more EXP. Shit. I never- oh, he never sent you that. I mean, hey, I appreciate the Pepsi Chan Boobas resurgence. I'm not sure what's okay. all- I'm not sure what's all the Coke Chan Boo- or Pepsi Chan Booba On, um, Ooh. on Pixiv. Fuck you, Micaiah! Fuck you! I hate you! I wish you signed that blood pack just to get more speed! <laughs> we'll call it the speed pack. <laughs> yes, the- the speed pack. Oh wait, he sent even more sauce. Hold up. Ooh, we got corn. Corn's booba yeah. next. Yeah. Corn. I like that, especially the especially the black outfit corn. That's my favorite one. Yeah. I like that as well. It actually makes her look kind of you know smashable. Hot. Ah, 
Haha, <laughs> you miss. Well, at least res is something, alright. And max speed is also nice. Are you ready to level up speed, mid Kaya? Yes, are you ready to level up speed? You stupid bitch. Nope. You, you dumbass. You fucking dumbass. <laughs> dumbass. You have any idea how angry this makes me? <laughs> well, you aren't called angry Luigi for nothing. <laughs> this is this is worse. This is this is worse. It's like it's like that squid. It's like that Squidward meme. <laughs> What was it? What was the Squidward meme where he's like, "Does this look like the face to you?" <laughs> oh yeah, I think I know what you're talking about. <laughs> or he says, "Does this look unsure to you?" Oh yeah, that's what I meant. He just makes a freaking realistic face. <laughs> yeah, that that's of, really funny. Of eating a Krabby Patty. <laughs> yeah, that that's where that legendary face comes from. Oh, I'm gonna look it up because I because I, I remember I, I gotta remember what it looks like. Squidward unsure. <laughs> yeah. Yes. Yes. Finally. She freaking levels up speed. <laughs> she is in the need for speed. There's that really funny face. Kitty. The the worst thing about about this is that I'm not going to get uh I'm not gonna get more birch tones. Rip. Also 35% speed growth. You know, Jacob, Ike literally has the same speed growth as Micaiah, but he literally- because freaking Ike can- can level up speed easily. Yeah, I don't know- I don't know what her excuse is. What, she just wants to level up more luck? Is that it? She wants to level up more freaking luck? Jeez, what a bastard she is. That's one tired looking kitty. You know, this is what happens when somebody gets Micaiah pregnant. <laughs> what? I don't even know. I'm just making I'm just thinking ways to make fun of her just be just because of how slow she is. Now as that be said up said something better. Her booba is slowing her down. <laughs> I was literally trying to make a sex joke, Jacob. Well, you kind of missed on that one. I know. Yeah, just like the freaking knight who missed. <laughs> Good timing. Well, well, at least that. Well, at least the joke landed. Like home, because, we're finally landing. Because it's because you could say that it's unexpected. That'd be a, that'd be a good thing to add on my soundboard. <laughs> you see, Jacob. This is why I'm, I keep telling you that I that I try to be really unfunny. Very unfunny. It's literally my thing. I I just want to be as unfunny as possible. Oh, he sent me Ivy too. Ooh, you're talking about the Ivy? Yeah. The one that has purple hair. Yep, that Ivy. Even though her hair looks more magenta. It's like, it's like, uh, it's like fuchsia. Maid of Dawn, you gotta stay there, bitch! No! That guy, that guy is the real antagonist of the game. That one guard. No! <laughs> you know what? You may be right about that. 
And the purge broke. Oh, I'm really, I'm really glad that the choicer voicer is getting more episodes. <laughs> for Vinny Vine Sauce. Well, that's why it's called the choiciest voice for a reason. Nah, the choicer voicer. It's an even better game. Ow. Because it, it's just, it's the choicest voice, but instead it's just meme voices. <laughs> Like, very meme-like voice. Yeah, like shit from YouTube poops, and like, 2020 memes and stuff like that. I like YTPs. Yeah, it, it's great. It's so funny. You know, I just wish that YTPs were funny again. I still think they're funny. Well, at least the old ones. <laughs> exactly, that's what I mean. I wish most YTPs were like the old ones. <laughs> Well, at least I'm happy that I have Toronto. <laughs> Jim, K aka Jim Carrey. Yep, aka the Jim Carrey who played as Dr. Eggman. Hey, I mean, I edited the music in Tomodachi Life and it, it loops properly, it doesn't break. Yeah, I wonder, I wonder why, because I'm sure it doesn't use BSTRM. Nope, it uses BCSTM. <laughs> Which is literally just BRSTMs, but for the 3DS. <laughs> is it better? Eh, not really. Same, same, uh, same so bit, same audio bit, right? Are you saying it's worse? No, it's about the same. The Wii and 3DS both use like the same audio compression. It's just the 3DS is a lower resolution system. I mean, if you, I mean, it uses. It uses two yeah. 240p screens, which when you combine that together, it's technically 480p, which is the same as the Wii. You know, JF, I will always defend the freaking 3DS no matter what. Man, I'm playing it. I'm playing it upscale in 1080p on Lemonade. It looks good. Yeah, I, I, I just don't care. I just don't care about enhancements. I just love my 3DS, and I'm never gonna sell it. Oh, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna sell mine either. I have. Um... My, all my old save files on there, and I'm keeping them. The fact that I still have my Paper Jam save file after 10 years, or 9 years, is it says a lot. <laughs> That's crazy. Yep, and I also have uh, my Mario Kart 7 save file on there from 10 years ago. I actually make that 12 years ago, because I'm pretty sure that's when Mario Kart 7 came out. Which again, that's crazy. My Smash you 4. Got a crit. I, my Smash 4 save file got deleted though, but I, I don't really care about that. <laughs> it's Smash 4. I f Jacob, <laughs> Smash 4 is literally. Jacob, Smash 4 is literally like melee, except just as bad. Because at least, because at least in Smash 4, it has many characters, but I don't think that many characters would save it. It only has two music. It's boring. And it's lame. I, 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 I'd argue Melee's better, because at least it has the event matches. It is better, but... You know what I could also argue? It has better stages, at least. Smash 4 for 3DS? I guess I could see the point there. Yeah, because it has some unique stages like Rainbow Road. True. Or, that, that, that is or, one... or, or what about Tomodachi Life? That is a really cool stage. You gotta admit. It's cool and concept, but not fun to play on. Yeah, it is. Pac, yeah, Pac really Maze. Cool. Yeah, Pac Maze was, was literally uh, goaded. Find Me. Crazy. Yep. Um. What else? What are 3DS okay. exclusives are there? Uh, Mute City. Yeah, Mute City, that's actually really cool. Poke floats? No. <laughs> no, Poke floats is not that good. I, I actually like Poke floats though. I mean, it's funny in Smash Universe at least, <laughs> just well, because I mean, the state the stage sometimes just breaks. Well, I mean, Poke floats is fun when you are doing this in a casual way. That's why I like it in Universe, because I play casually in Universe. That's the only Smash game I play casually in, I think. Yeah, I could see where you're coming from. Well, maybe, uh, uh, what I mean to say is I'm slightly less casual when I play Trash. <laughs> well, Jacob, you'd be surprised that I'm not, that I'm the most casual person of all time. 
thing is, I don't like to play trash much, because it takes like 50 minutes to boot up, and then if it crashes, then you're fucked. <laughs> but that's why it's not fun to you? Yep. I have too many mods now, and I, I, I'm like the kind of guy where like, more is better, and if you take shit away from me that I have already, then I just get sad. So, I'm not getting rid of my mods. If I get rid of any mods, it's just gonna feel, feel like something's missing, you know? That's the yeah. thing. With, that's the thing with my trash rebuff mods. Is I just keep adding on to it. Yeah, I can see where you're coming from. Although I haven't added on to it recently. Like the only thing I add is like a couple songs every few months. It's not much. But it's at least something. It's something. I haven't really, I haven't really bothered adding new characters either because, yeah, that's also annoying to set up. Cause it requires a lot of troubleshooting and a, a lot of file editing and stuff. I've added two characters recently, and that's about it. I had Gohan and Dialuk, or whatever his name is. I wonder who's that. Uh, he, he's some, like, sword guy from Genshin. We even but I was mean, but I mean, it's like, well, he has a custom moveset, so I'll add him. I mean, does anybody even care about Genshin? Nope. I don't. I certainly, I certainly don't either. I mean, I like the waifus, but that's about it. I think the game is hot garbage. <laughs> Why hot garbage? Because it's a gacha game, bro. Gacha games suck. And I'll say that until I die. That's fine. <laughs> let's, uh, let's see. We found some hot sauce. Ooh. Oh, yes. That is hot sauce, indeed. I, might, I think I might, uh... I think I'm gonna burn from that. Ooh. <laughs> I'm gonna get burned by YouTube? No. Like, that hot sauce is so hot that I'm burning, dude. Oh yeah, I'm sure you are <laughs> burning. Yeah, like... Burn, baby, burn! Like Pyra burn, says, baby, burn. you'll get burned. <laughs> oh, yeah. I was just referencing a song. A song that I probably don't know. I mean, Jacob, it's fine. You don't have to know the song. I can't know everything in life. But what I do know is that... I'm on enemy phase. And one of my units is gonna be dead. <laughs> I will send that gif. Okay, you can. And yeah, yes. and, and, and Zeppi, I see you've been, you've been, uh... Looking around my my pixel book marks now, <laughs> so good for you. You find some good sauce in there. What what did Zeppi do? He's looking at my pixel because he it's all all the good sauce that I save. That oh, way okay. that way I that way I don't have to send it to him. Although I will still send some stuff, like like I said, just not gonna send everything. So if you want bonus sauce, check my pixel. <laughs> I'm just gonna say okay. Cause okay, <laughs> okay. not? Okay. I saw a cleric crit. <laughs> yeah, I saw that too. You know, Jacob, I'm just happy that I have Toronto because at least he is one of the one of the few units that I have. Mm-hmm. He's one of my he might be one of my favorite units in, in the Dawn Brigade. I mean, I'm just glad that he gets a lot of screen time in this game, considering he shows up so late in Path of Radiance. That's true. But at least he, he'll he ha have the chance to level up even further. Yep. Okay, we're almost done this map, though. We're on turn 9 right now. Yeah, we are getting close. And you know what but that means? You know what that means, guys? Ike's gonna move in a few turns. <laughs> yeah. And this is gonna be just... This is gonna be really bad. It reminds me of the, um, it reminds me of the Ashnard fight on Maniac Mode, where he starts chasing you around the map. <laughs> yeah, I think I know what he's talking about. Yeah, that shit's scary, dude. I mean, honestly, Ashnard himself is pretty scary. Yeah, but his music slaps. He's got good taste in music. Oh, it, oh he does. You wanna, know, you wanna know the reason why he's scary? Because he maxed out everything? <laughs> Not just that, but he actually craves for a battle. Like, he doesn't care if he dies. That too. <laughs> Good job, Laura. We appreciate you. 
Yeah. Even though she is gonna slowly increase res, which is fine. I can't, I can't wait till Ike is just like, I'm gonna take the battle to you, and he starts I mean, moving. I mean, sure, she doesn't have the highest res, but at least she'll have res to... <laughs> Ashnard is a masochist. A lot. Oh, he is. Oh, the sauce just keeps getting better, dude. Look at this. Yeah, yeah but I want to see my... Oh, You're that is that is a sufficient enough. That is a sufficient enough friggin' uh, level up. At least because all I can say is that I friggin' got uh, str I literally got s defense and res. She's actually gonna max out both res and defense. Good. She's tanky. <laughs> Well, if Ashnard's a masochist, then um, count me in because I'm also a masochist. But you didn't hear oh, me. Boy. But you didn't hear me say that. Jill does need strength. Yeah, she really does need strength. However, her her strength is really low. <laughs> well, yeah. not severely low. Still not as annoying as my mid Kaya not leveling up speed though. Yeah, I mean, hey, at least she'll be tanky. At least tankiness is enough. I mean, I think Jim Carrey's a better tank. Yeah. Because he is a friggin' armor knight. True. And what's funny is that armor knights don't have the highest defense. I mean, the highest attack. You wanna know who? You wanna know which unit has the highest attack? Hmm. What? Nolan. <laughs> he actually. He actually maxes out like 40 strength. Oh no! Oh this shit! This is bad. They try. They're trying. Oh god! You dumbass knight! Why'd you go fucking soaring, bro? It's like the worst mistake you could do. Although Soren's just vibing there, he's just like, "Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna kick your ass." Like, are you oh, safe? Yeah. Wait, was that a dumb- that was a dumb question, wasn't it? I don't think any of us are safe at the moment. Are you guys finished with the preparations? Yeah, the rest of the force is on the way. They should arrive any minute. Alright, once we merge, we'll launch the attack. Oh shit, I- I better get out right now. Oh shit. Raphael, are you ready? Let's go look for Micaiah. Do not leave my side. These- these Barak- Look edgy. <laughs> <laughs> edgy. Yes, que Queen Nyla. Uh, I'll be closer than your own shadow. Cowabunga! Now I'm gonna find Shredder, dude. <laughs> He's gonna find Shredder. <laughs> I'm surprised you know who Shredder is. I know a bit of TMNT. Yeah, same. I did grow up watching a little bit of TMT before. When I was a kid, oh, I, I haven't seen this show. I just know about about it from like the games that I've seen from it, the TMNT games and the AVGN. That is, that is my exposure to TMNT. My family didn't even have internet, Ooh. so so <laughs> we just so me and my family just survives every year. Yep. That soldier thought he was the main character. <laughs> yeah, he went up against Soren, dude. He thought he was gonna win. But no. No. Just look at Soren. Look how much I build him. <laughs> oh my god, yeah. <laughs> I literally build him to be this great. These are my final few turns. All I can say is that they've done an excellent job. <laughs> yeah, they, that knight did not have plot armor. I mean, the only one that I might even max that I might even max out the freaking the that I might reach the third tier class for the for the mid gate is probably Aura. Yeah. The only, the only Wait, units I care about in the mid gate are Jill, Laura. Nolan and um, Jim Carrey. 
Yeah, everyone else is just whatever. Oh, and Volu. <laughs> he's okay. Yeah, he's decent. I'm surprised that I kept him for this long. Bye, Galia. Oh, that's nice. And I do love that it play. It is playing. Um, what was the song called? Path to Advance or something? What do you mean, time of action? Oh yeah, time of action. <laughs> oh, oh, oh shit! Hey, <laughs> I have to get out. Oh, Jacob, I think everybody is. I think most of most of my members in the freaking Dawn Brigade are dead. I can't even outrun them! You just gotta try. Yeah, the la yeah, the last few turns are gonna be really scary. <laughs> this is gonna be exciting. Now I have to shelter. You found more good saws? God damn, dude. Save it for after the chapter, though. Oh, good on that knight. He's holding the fort. Oh boy. Okay, at least at least they're getting dis at least at least that knight is distracting them. Ooh, ooh, ooh. That's not good. Jacob, I'm literally outnumbered. <laughs> this, is like, this is like the most nerve-wracking uh, part of this chapter. Yeah, I, I said I'll. Uh, I you know you sent the sauce, but I'll look at it when I'm when we're done the chapter. You know what I mean, Jacob? I'm literally scared of this chapter because of that reason. Some crazy shit. <laughs> Run, oh. bitch. The gang's all here. Well, I think it's time for me to end the turn. I think it's over. <laughs> uh, good thing Rolf sucks, though. <laughs> Yeah, that's true. Oh, th thank God. That God that night came in. Yeah. I mean, it doesn't do much, but yeah. Why would you seek me out? I won't have any mercy on my enemies. That goes for former allies, too. Oh, my God. <laughs> Damn, Ike. Well, Jacob, at least I'm gonna go back to the freaking Grail Mercenaries. Oh, fuck I you. literally how, how killed you my most damage? powerful unit in the game. Oh, oh no. <laughs> Yo, Oscars ain't messing around. Probably my strongest unit in in this chapter of the the Grail Mercenaries is probably Titania. Yeah, she's not messing around either. Maid of Dawn, the enemy is approaching. Please, you must withdraw inside the castle. Our defense has been broken. We did everything we could. It's only a matter of time now. Dane soldiers, pull back immediately. Take up positions inside the castle. We won't let them take us without a fight. Thank God this chapter's over. Well, we did. We are it. never going to use the Don Brigade ever again. Wait, really? You don't have to use them ever again? No, not real. Not at least separately. Oh, they're gonna join us? Hell yeah. 
The inner gate's been breached. It's only a matter of time before they break through the inner walls, dude. Yeah. Everybody's going to join. What are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing? I didn't do anything. Okay. Oh shit! Give me a sec. It was fast. We didn't get a, we didn't get a chance to rest. Isn't there anything we can do? King Pelvis worked so hard to find the answer. Was it for nothing? There must be something. A rumor, or folklore, anything. Hold on. Didn't Lady Almedaha seem to know something about the Blood Pact? Come to think of it, she recognized the mark of the Pact on Pelvis's arm right away. Like she'd seen one before. You're right. Why didn't I realize it sooner? Where is she? General, it's no use. We can't hold him off any longer, dude. Sorry, I just tapped the button really fast because my internet is kind of lagging right now. Oh, boo. Yeah, it, yeah, it happens sometimes. Enemy troops have broken through and are headed this way. Escape while you can, dude. Now, I must find Lady Imelda. Everything depends on it. Yeah, I notice the inputs are coming in a lot later. Break down the gate. They won't come out, we'll just let ourselves in. All forces advance. Oh, I could got a problem. A big problem. All oh, this battlefield chaos is starting to really affect the Lagoos. They're on the verge of losing a troll. Can't stop them, Mike. If they find Makaya, they're going to tear apart. I guarantee it. Blast. We need to get them under control. Where's Skipper? Sheesh, what a relief to finally have the end of this thing in sight. I can't believe what a fight the Danian army put up, especially considering their numbers. Wait a minute. Hey, Elki, what the heck's going on the horizon? It's flying towards us. The flapping sounds heavier than a wyvern. Sounds huge. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. All units, get down. Dragon. Oh, shit, it's the black dragon. Bro. I think I know who it is. The Dark Dragon Blade. No. No. Oh. Boom. It's Alencia. All of you are ordered to throw down your weapons and cease fighting. Do this for your own welfare. Anna, Alencia, what's going on here? It's a black dragon of Goldoa. Captain Falcon, what's going on? Yeah! Why are you asking me? All I know is that I am not ready to step up to a black dragon. Did you see that blast? Point taken. All units retreat. Platoon commanders, gather your men. Steve Harvey is back. <laughs> no, it's not Steve Harvey. Oh. Yeah, the delay is real. What just happened? Why did the Apostles' army leave? And what was that horrible sound? Well, I'm sorry that the delay is real. It's just, like I said, my internet is getting laggy. Yeah. Especially for Parsec. Boo. Micaiah, dude! Micaiah! Oh, it's, uh, the, the Prince. Kurth, where have you been? I haven't seen you since you left for home. How did you get here? Why did you even come to a horrible place like this? I wanted to save you, and my sister as well. Your sister? She's here? 
Never mind that now. I'm just glad you're safe. Are you hurt? No, I don't think so. I'm just very confused right now, and I haven't gained any speed level ups. I'm sure she doesn't. The subhumans are here, dude. Protect the man with your lives, or else we're gonna eat shit. Stop, stand down, all of you. You're going to avoid, I can guarantee it. Oh. Oof. Toho dodging be like. <laughs> I get that. Queen Nyla, Raphael. Thank you. Thank you so much. It's all right. It's all right, Micaiah. It'll be all right. Cowabunga. Yeah, I forgot about Kurt, too. Apostles Army Camp Dane. The Black Dragon is Prince Kurt Naga. Sheesh, I thought the lions got big. Ah, it's the sun, is it? I thought maybe the Dragon King. Eh. I shrunk a bit in his old age. You all know the Dragon Prince of Goldoa. Yeah, Goldoa hosted a meeting of the Goose Royalty three years ago. This is when Captain Falcon and I met him. Lindsay and I met him around the same time. I say he was a nice kid, except that he's older than all of us put together. The Prince hopes to avoid the complete destruction of Dane and its people. He wishes to stop the fighting. We would like to ask you to implement a ceasefire and hold the peace talk. We have attempted to hold peace talks with Dane on multiple occasions. They refuse to listen to reason and instead choose to fight. We have no more time to waste on people who choose war or peace at every turn. Your people are waiting for you in Benyon. Is that what presses you? It's not just that. All this, all this cloud strife and chaos has affected the medallion. It's shining brighter each day. No, it can't be. The blue flame burns once more. The light that radiates from this medallion looks like blue fire. It's this flaming aura that earned the medallion its other name, the Fire Emblem. Roll credits. This is not the j time for jokes right now. <laughs> The Fire Emblem. The flames on the Fire Emblem indicate the awakening of the Dark God. If the war is allowed to continue, nothing can stop the Dark God's awakening. We must halt this fighting. <laughs> nothing can stop Metal Gear now. If there's a way to stop the fighting, we shall do everything in our power to aid in that effort we've pursued peace since this began. Then let us wait until Prince Krithnaga returns. He's speaking with the leaders of Dane now. He's also speaking facts. Lindsay, what are you doing here? Did Anna and Kurth ask you to bring them this battle? No, that wasn't the case. Prince Krithnaga and I ran into each other on our way here. We are, ac we are actually in Dane to look for the Count Bastion for of faith fair oh shit dracula yeah lucy you're here too of course i cannot let her majesty out of my sight you know that bastian or dracula he'd been so good about sending me reports until recently he was searching for the black knight right there he is yep after the Mad King's War, Benyon sent to Envoy to investigate war crimes committed during Ashnard's reign. Bro really committed war crimes. The Black Knight has already left Dane before the Empire's Observer arrived. Where he went where he went remains a mystery. But he was the last piece of information we received from from Dracula. Then he sent word saying that something more important had come up with regar regards to Crimea. He's been missing ever since. I hadn't heard a single word from him. Dracula likes to keep his e-secrets. He's probably just laying low somewhere. 
I'm not so sure. He must have found something important, something new piece of information that he had to pursue. Was it his file of secrets? <laughs> yes. <laughs> I ordered Jeffrey to watch over Crimea and came here to begin a search for Bastian. It's too dangerous for you and Lucia to travel by yourselves. Why don't you come with us? Everyone would love to have you two around. Thank you, Ike. We'll gladly accept the offer. <laughs> In reality, Ike is misogynistic. <laughs> Well, Jacob, we finally made it. To the to last, the last... Part. Yep. Yep. Queen Alincia and the dragons of Now this this is where things start to get really dire. Oh shit. Yep. You'll see why. In the medallion grows more fierce with each passing day to prevent the awakening of the evil trapped within. Of course there's going to be war crimes. However, the Apostle and her army refused Like I said, every single nation is fighting each other. Though they hoped That's not good. Would cease fighting. I know. Battle was inevitable. But something worse is about to happen. Yeah, something much worse is about to happen after Jack. this chapter. End game from a pain awakening. Oh shit, Fire Emblem Awakening mentioned? <laughs> this game existed before Fire Emblem Awakening was a thing. Shh. Blood Pact? A piece of parchment force due into the hopeless war? How terrible! I'm sorry for what you've been through, Micaiah. Well, the Empire in the Empire continues. The Apostles' people awaits for her return as they fight against the Senator Armstrong. Casualties mount each day. We know how urgently the Apostles' army needs to reach the Empire. However, if we let their their army pass through, Dane, the Senator Armstrong will surely evoke the Blood Pact and destroy us, and will destroy the Blue Hedgehog before me. No way! I can't believe this! <laughs> no way! I can't believe this! But why haven't they told you about the Apostle Army about this? Surely the alliance between your army and theirs could overcome the Senator Armstrong. Cowabunga! Where's my- where's uh- where's Eggman saying, fuck you, Moon? <laughs> I forgot where that sound is. Aw, oh, damn. You found it! <laughs> there it is. Donuts. The ads? Oh noes. <laughs> Why ads? Just get an ad blocker, bro. Donuts. Ad blocker doesn't work on Twitch. Well, I have a Twitch ad blocker. Well good. Donuts. Donuts. Well, attacking the Senator Armstrong is not an option for us. If it were, we would have marched against them when this all started right after i team up with knuckles <laughs> in in the sonic movie part two <laughs> idris elba knuckles just to find the friggin mask nobody room that was cares. hidden on earth nobody cares if we were to side with ike the senator armstrong would use the curse against us the death of the senator Senator Armstrong will not stop the curse. No matter what happens, the, res the end result remains the same. Obliteration of the obliteration of Dane. What a tragedy. Is there any hope for Dane at all? There is one person who holds a glimmer of hope for all of us. And you know who is Glimmer? It's Mommy. Queen Imelda. I was thinking about Glimmer from Xenoblade. Oh. <laughs> Queen Imelda, what do you know about the Blood Pact? You know something, don't you? I saw the look on your face. You know something even before Pelvis told us about the Pact. If there's something you know that we don't, please tell us. <laughs> Lady Imelda? Haven't you done enough already? It's done. Finished. Nothing matters anymore. There's nothing we can do. 
My pelvis. My pelvis is. Amelda, get your. Get a hold of yourself. Cat? I can't pretend that I know that you are going. I know what you're going through. But for pelvis's sake, or at least Akechi's sake, you must control yourself. Remember that your son made his final sacrifice in order to protect the people of Dane. Honor his memory now and help us. Yeah, you're right, Kurth. I'll try. Oh, thank you, Queen Lady Imelda. Now, what can you tell us about the Blood Pact? <laughs> Nothing, apparently. In the Banyan era, year 626, a terrible plague swept through Dane, killing over a thousand people. I remember the horror, horror of the disease. King Ashnar took the throne after the plague, killed most of the royal family, including his father. The tragedy is still fresh in my mind. That was no disease. It was the curse of a blood pact. What? what? It was all plotted by the hus by my husband in a bid to claim the throne of Dane. Ashnard, aka Palpatine, tricked his father into signing a blood pact with a traveling wise man. The Emperor convinced the king that he was assigning a contract to procure the services of a wise man, which was true in a fashion. With the pact signed, Palpatine had the wise man evoke the curse. My husband looked in triumph as the royal family began to wither. The power of the curse killed every royal in line for the throne. It was brilliant. With no one to block his way to the throne, Palpatine executed his master stroke. He killed his father and took the crown from his head. Ishnard killed his own father, the King of Dane? And what about the others? A thousand people died for his insane plot. Just for milk and family guy. <laughs> There's no point in dwelling on old wounds. Besides, the peasants didn't matter. They had no vision. The Emperor, on the other hand. What's important is what happened after the King's death. Palpatine wasn't cursed by the Blood Pact. He wasn't cursed? How's that possible? In order to break the curse of the Blood Pact, two conditions must be met. The destruction of the document itself, and the death of one bound to it. Either condition by itself is not enough. I watched it happen. Palpatine killed his father, then tore apart the pact. And before my eyes, the mark of a pact from the dead's king arm faded. You know, Jacob, I just found it unbelievable that they had to show an Im had to show a freaking image of what of what actually happened. Damn. He even. He even carried that sword as well, just to prove it. <laughs> a bit late, but I wish he added 150 more years from 626. What's so special about that? Hmm. That's what I'm gonna wonder about as well. Anyways. The destruction of the document and the death of the One Bound, or Earthbound in general. Oh, 776. I get it now. <laughs> Wait, what? What do you mean, 776? You know, 3CS776? <laughs> oh, okay, I get it. Okay, now I now I get it. How could you, Imelda? How can you not tell us? You know how long. Did he say 150 years? Yeah. I didn't okay, get I, I, I didn't get it. I thought it was supposed to be a funny sex number. No, it's a title number. Now it makes sense. Anyways, did you read this dialogue? Yeah. Okay. Because I was terrified. I knew that once you found out the truth, you would butcher my dear son to save your doomed country. I would have done anything to sell my pelvis. That's why I didn't say anything. How could I? In the end, though, it wasn't enough. I might get a different cutscene if I, if I go through my playthrough. Probably. Yeah. I might tell you about it later. Sure, why not? Almeda, you're stronger than this. You were always the brave one when we were young. 
Huh? I know your grief, but grieving will not bring Pelvis back. Now is the time when you must be strong to put Pelvis's, or at least Akechi's spirit to rest, help carry out his dying wish and ensure the safety of his homeland. But he was... He was everything to me. How could I go on without him? I'm still here, dear sister. You have family. Sister? Lady Imelda's your sister? I, I can see it now. I can see the resemblance. I mean, I already knew the resemblance, to be honest. Anyways, I received your message, my sister, and have come to help. Please, Imelda. Allow me to protect Dane for you and for Pelvis. Do not lose hope. You are not alone anymore and never shall be again. Oh, Keth Naga, thank you. I'm so sorry for everything I put you and father through. I'm so sorry. So, would that make Ashnard his brother in law? You could say that, <laughs> yeah. It's an interesting thing to think about yet. Yeah, I'm waiting for this yeah. cutscene to end because I want to go take a piss and get at some tea while Jose's doing preparations and then I'll look oh. at the sauce. You want to hear something funny, Jacob? What? A Ashnard actually has a son. Yeah. But I'm not going to spoil who the son is. Okay. This will be a surprise. Sir Ike, I have just received a very disturbing message from Prince Kurthnaga. Don't tell me. No luck, right? It's far worse than that. Prince Kurthnaga's decided to fight for Dane. What? Why? He was supposed to stop them from fighting, and now he wants to fight us instead? Ah, uh, it's just perfect. He has a good reason to side with them, but I'm afraid I cannot tell you why. Wonderful. So we still have to fight Dane. And they've added one of the supposedly neutral dragons of Goldoa to their army, huh? I'm sorry, Ike. I'll try to reason with Prince Kurth again. It was the prince's wish to come here. Uh, the uh, fucking... What was his name again? Scar? <laughs> yeah, I think it was Scar. I think it was Scar, no, right? No, oh, that, no, oh wait, no, that was, um... That was, uh, Steve Harvey. Oops. I got the mix No, this up. is Steve Harvey. Steve Harvey Where knows nothing of this visit. Be that as it may, for a prince of the dragon tribe to stand on a battlefield, it is unacceptable. I must talk him out of it. You should have said King of Family Feud. King of Family Feud, yep, there we go. <laughs> Zeppi knows who it is already. I'm sorry, Anna. I know you're doing your best to. Will you talk to him with that stone? You already know what, what joke I was going to make there. <laughs> what? It's a stone, Luigi. Yep, yes, I knew you were about to say that. We dragons have the power to sense the presence of our allies. That's a pretty cool ability. If that ally is someone we care for very much, then we can communicate telepathically. With the Sending Stone, we can use this telepathy across extreme distances. Oh, so like a cell phone. That's what I was about to say. <laughs> it's literally like a... Well it's, well, it's basically a medieval version of a cell phone. Medi medieval cell phone. Except only Divine Dragons can use them. I just hope he listens to me. We can't afford to feel the flames of the Fire Emblem. Burr, 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 burr. It's almost done. <laughs> Roll credits. Fire Emblem Dawn. Roll credits. Radiant Dawn. Yep. Do what you can to convince the Prince to stay out of this. I would prefer to avoid a fight, but once again, Mid Kaya isn't giving us much of a choice. Or Slow Kaya. Slow Kaya. I'll do my best, Sir Bike. Okay, now I can go take a piss. Finally. <laughs> I'll be back, guys. You can do the preparations. Alright. Ooh, a silencer. Holy shit, this music is... It's really gotten depressing as hell. It's literally like I'm in the final days living on Earth. <laughs> I 
can't believe it. good. This is just me testing out this. Well, all I can say is that I'm pretty satisfied with this level up. Speechless of what I'm listening to. back for a little bit. Jacob, I am this speechless. Why? Just listen to the music. Damn, it's so sad. Also, you get to see Khalil again. Yeah. Yeah. He is really low-leveled, after all. Smash! I can but I can... But I can manage to level her up quite a bit more. Anyways, guys, it's that time you've been waiting for. It's time to look at the sauces at the Ascent. Alright. <laughs> well, <laughs> it's it's Goldberry, alright. Yo, uh, Goldberry, woo! That's what I've been waiting for! <laughs> I love this. I'm serious, I really do love what I'm seeing. Yeah, Goldberry is great. Imagine, you know, ima you imagine Goldberry and Heather in the same game. Oof. <laughs> well... That could burn down a building. <laughs> keep dreaming, Jacob. Keep dreaming. Anyway, let me put that away. <laughs> Oops, I forgot, yeah. to, I forgot to turn off Discord. But yeah, like I'm saying... Damn, I can't believe things are going really south... ...in this game. Yeah, unfortunately. <gasps> we get Dev Dan on our team again! Yeah. <laughs> keep dreaming. Aw, oh, damn it. It's it's literally like we're at the final moments of of the game, which we are actually. Technically we're not, because we're not even in part four yet. Yeah. But this music feels like it represents we're living our last days on Earth. Well, it's a little too dramatic, but alright. <laughs> yeah, so I mean I I mean I c I mean I only say this because you're, like I said, something bad is about to happen in the next scene. 
after we finish the last chapter. Oh shit, well, hopefully, um, hopefully I don't miss it, because I gotta go, um, put my fries in the oven. I'm making fries, by the way. I'm gonna put fries in the oven in, like, All three, right. in, like, three minutes. Alright, Jacob, this is the last chapter. Let's Augers. do this. <laughs> See what I mean when this music kind of sounds like Persona 3's, uh, Memories of the City? I can kind of hear it. <laughs> I'm not saying it sounds like a like it. It's literally the vibe that gives it away. Yeah. Oh, we're already starting out in a battlefield. Okay. Yep. The Apostles' army has left the castle, dude. All right. Order all units to stand by until they encounter the enemy forces. Holy shit! <laughs> that portrait actually looks kind of cool. What? I'm not gonna lie. What the, what, the guard? Yeah. Hey, he's got, like, spike spikes on his helmet. Well, it looks like horns, actually. Yeah, horns. He's horny. Everyone, there's still hope for Dane. We are the key to that hope. But first, we must win this battle. Yeah, I don't think you're gonna win. Doggy! Why are you still here? <laughs> You must return to the Apostles' army before that battle begins. That army has enough troops. I think you could use some help on our side. And Grayson and Leanne both fight for the people that they love. Cowabunga! I shall do the same. Even if that means fighting against them, I shall fight for Dane on your behalf. Cowabunga! Hey, thank you both. It means a lot to me. But are you sure? After all, this seems like a hopeless battle. No dir. It's too soon for you to give up hope. You have the Prince Dragon of Goldoa on your side. That counts for something. That does count for something. Gareth is a Prince of Goldoa? So he is a Lagoose. Not just a Lagoose. He is a black dragon. The black dragons are the strongest of the Lagoose tribes. We have a chance. If Queen Amelda's brother's a black dragon, that means the queen herself must be also Lagoose. Seems like a, a complicated mess to me. Just the same. He is a powerful ally. You're right. If we can stand our ground, there'll be hope for another day. Each day that Dane survives another day we'll have earned for it. Mm. Alright, I gotta go uh, put my fries in the oven. Should I pause? Uh, just just take a few more lines. We're, we are gonna get close to the preparations. Okay. Even though, like, I gotta go with I gotta go to the oven, like, right now, so... <laughs> I'm just, It'll be quick, I'm just, I promise. I'm, I'm just gonna pause. I'll be back in, like, a few minutes. Okay, I'm back. <laughs> Onward, my brothers. Hold nothing back. We must end this battle quickly. <laughs> I am the creator of the animation of Light Mod. Oh, cool. <laughs> Anyways, hello, chat. I am back. I think Jose went AFK though. Okay. All right. Oh, good. Okay. I had to take a leak. <laughs> well, good thing you did that now. <laughs> when I got back. Why? Anyways. Oh crap. Wow, that's a problem. Uh, guys, it looks like Prince Raphael's fighting for the other side. What do we do now? It is his choice. We can't do anything about it. Yeah! Well, his choice or not, it makes things a lot more complicated for us. <laughs> I just wanted to tell you that because I didn't want to feel like a douche by telling you about the mod without saying I created it. Yeah, okay. it, it's fine. At least I get to talk to a creator, so I'm famous. 
Nah, just because you talk to a creator doesn't make you automatically famous, okay? Fuck. <laughs> he has sided with our enemies? Has he lost his mind? My dear stupid brother. Prince, what are you doing here? What about the medallion? Weren't you supposed to be... Luan is watching over it now. Either we convince Raphael to come back to our side, or do we drag him unconscious on the backside over there, just so I could just stuff him in my <laughs> in my blue falcon. I love how blood I love how bloodthirsty Captain Falcon is in this chapter. Or in this like just in part three in general. Like he tried to murder a dude once. <laughs> He didn't even hesitate to drop Soth. Yeah, bro bro has n bro gives no fucks. Yeah, he had the guts to do it. Yeah, your majesty. <laughs> yes, dad. <laughs> there he is. Prince Kirthnaga. Ike. Ike and her. Bike. Anna. What will you do now, Anna? Are you gonna go over the other side too? King of Family Feud has expressly forbidden us from choosing sides. The Dragon Tribe must not fight. I shall attempt to stop the Prince. <laughs> he tried to murder Soth to raise up Alincia. Oh yeah, that's right. That's what I just said. Forgot about that. Do what you need to do. Just be careful out there, alright? I mean, what is Enna even gonna do? She was weak on in the last game. Yeah. I don't think she's gonna do shit in this game as well. Probably not. Yes, sir, Ike. Ooh. There's our girl. Valencia, please stay back. If a chance for peace talk arises, I want you to mediate the whole show. I understand. Please be safe. <laughs> okay, okay, bye, guys. You get, like, one second of screen time. Okay, everyone, get moving. Let's get this mess over with. Ooh. Oh boy. At least this chapter will be a lot easier, though. <laughs> it's gonna be really long, I will say this much. That's fine, I'm, I'm down for a three-hour episode, since it's the end of part three. If she has Wrath and Resolve, probably, there's a chance. True. Pretty sure we gave her something like that in Path of Radiance. We did. Alright, so welcome back to Jose is Incredibly Based. <laughs> Who said that? Me. I'm saying that. <laughs> why? Why do you say I'm incredibly based? I mean, look at your fucking team. You got Ileana, Heather, Nephany, Titania, <laughs> even Soren and Shinnin. Yep. And me and me Marcia and Khalil <laughs> and Mr. Van Driesen. It's like the most based team of all time. Yeah, uh, very based. What else missed? And forget about Brom. And Brom. All right, there we go. Good team. If we had spot for one more, I might consider putting on like horror or something. Well, I have Sigrun, which I'm happy to see her. Oh, she's nice. One more yeah. thing about the mod: the guy who made Neo Light helped out. Oh, he's a co. He's a co-developer now. Cool. <laughs> Who's telling you all of this? The creator of me of uh, animation of light, dude. He's spilling the tea. Well, okay then. I I know for sure Zach's gonna make gonna want me to play that shit. Well, okay then. Hmm. Yeah, I am incredibly based <laughs> on my team. Yep. But I, I, I wouldn't have it any other way, honestly. I wonder why. Because I like uh, this team, too. Yeah, I don't think <laughs> what she was needs to be here anymore. What, what is Mia's weapons? Good point. I didn't really look. Why does she have two steel swords? <laughs> One is a steel blade. The steel blade is tremendously powerful. That's a, that clearly says silver blade, bro. I mean, yes, silver blade. That I should have said silver instead of steel. But yeah, this this is the silvered sword. 
this <laughs> is two steel the swords. Silver. And this is the silver blade. Probably should have just sold the steel sword with the 15 uh, uses left. Maybe I'll sell the both of the. I'll go back to base just in case. Okay, good. You're you're able to do that now. But yeah. Well, three more minutes, and I gotta go check on my fries. Even though I don't get much shit, I'll just. All I can say is I'm just happy. <laughs> kind of reminds me. Uh, kind of, it sounds like something Armstrong would say. You sack of shit. <laughs> you sack of shit. I'll just save just in case. See, yeah. we're in the end game. And save state too. So why not? But let me see the maps. I'm just dealing with very weak units, unfortunately. The only units you'll really want to be carry about is like. Jim Carrey and Laura. This is the one that I should worry about. I should worry about her. Oh, she's gonna have 34 strength. <laughs> yep. That's a lot. And her speed, she max she probably maxes out speed. 38 speed, that is a lot. She's gonna double pretty much all your units. Even he well, except she won't e except double Heather. Except Heather. Heather will be fine. I think she will double Nephany. Maybe. But yeah, this she is a threatening unit, I will say this much. She will be a threat. Who who will Oh, this is the one you know, this this one I might be either worried or not. Well he's he gonna, he's gonna have thirty defense. Which and is thirty strength. And thirty res. Wait, how yeah. do you know all of this? Because whenever Lagoos transform, they get double stats. He has Night Tide and he has Shove. I just want to check N Nyla just in case Savage? she has Glare. She has Glare, she has Guard, Form Shift, Savage. Can inflict damage at triple strength rating and have enemy skill for a turn? Oh boy. Yeah, like I said, she is going to be a threat. <laughs> Play up, I played a Fire Emblem game, guys. Yay. <laughs> okay, now now would be a good time to check on my fries. So All right, you, can you, do that. you can finish preparations. <laughs> Jacob just remakes this music. Okay, that's really cool. Okay, you know what? I'll, I'll applaud Jacob for this. That's really cool of him. Yeah, I just didn't have to. I just couldn't wait this much, so I'll just leave it at that. Maybe can maybe Jacob can do a voice out over if he plans to edit. I don't know. I don't think he will do that. All right, I'm back. You just missed the dialogue. Oh, rip. Yeah. I just couldn't wait that long, I'm sorry. <laughs> this sounds like Trial of Radiance. 
Yeah, I already knew that you changed this music. But that's a good, <laughs> but that's a good choice. I will say that's a good choice. Yeah, I know, right? This really fit. This kind. This really does fit the final level, or at least the final <laughs> stage. <laughs> Based. Yeah. Damn! Look how look at how much of a unit Brom is. Yeah, he's huge. Yeah, this was one of the other songs that I changed. Nephany, Tiss as though I'm the only one living thanks to you. Just thinking about you, dying. <laughs> My sight goes really dark and I can't even stop crying. Please hear me and stay safe. Alright, same to you. Wholesome. They really do care for each other. Yeah, country, country, people gotta look out for each other. Yeah, it's really nice. Also, what's so, that What's that weird, like, thing in the top right corner? I have no idea. It's probably, like, the flames of the Fire Emblem or something. That, that might be the case. Well, yeah, I'm glad you guys like- I'm glad you guys like my music pick. And they still play the Devoted. That's actually really cool. <laughs> Hell yeah. Cannon, cannon ship? No, you can't say that. Brom has a wife. <laughs> exactly. Aw, oh, shit. Oh no, Soren. <laughs> okay, well, I hope he doesn't die. Okay, he's gonna die. Unless he dodges. Unlikely, actually. Likely. Yep, Soren's dead! <laughs> Good start to the map, guys. Oh my god. Looks like I can't save him. Oh, you didn't know? Well, now you know. Yeah, Brahm's married. That's how he had a kid. Uh, that's how he had seven kids, actually. I'm pretty sure he had, like, seven kids. He did. And Nephany, um... I don't know what Nephany's relationship is, if she even has one. Let's just hope this is different. We well, got to see more Khalil in action. That's always nice to see. Yep, and she's dead. Bro, what the fuck? Your units are dying, dude. I can't even save anybody. What the heck? Hmm, rough start to this this map. At least this yep. music will make it bearable, though. I really hope you're right about that. Maybe shove? Hmm... Maybe. I wish I had rescue. Now that'd be nice. Use the warp staff. <laughs> no, I don't have a warp staff. Fuck. They're going after Skipper. They Think. are. He'll manage. Yeah, they, they, these units are pretty fucking tough. I know. This is not going to be an easy chapter, I will say that much. Yeah. Because there's a lot of units. There's a lot of enemies that I have to deal with. Yeah, at least you got Captain Falcon and um, Skipper on your team, though. 
Yeah, that's good. Oh shit! Oh shit! The is music, <laughs> the music does kind of sound funny sped up. It does. See the number changes. Oh, three. Now it says three. Four. I think I get what what's going on. You have to get to a certain number or something? No. It's every unit that you kill. Oh. Good. It's 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 keeping a body count. <laughs> More games need that. Oh shit. Man, he's dead. <laughs> wow, he sucks. <laughs> They're strong. We can't even slow them down. Sorry, but I'm turning back. I wish my units were able to just say, sorry, I'm leaving when they die. Nine hey, dead units. Should probably have yeah, missed he heal on um, him first. I know. <laughs> Dude, he can't even double! Now he can. Just play casual mode? Yeah, I know. <laughs> but this game doesn't have casual mode. It really doesn't. Oh wow, that, that, that guy that I don't care about. Oh, all this chaos, I can barely see straight. He's actually being affected by the freaking medallion. Oh, shit. Yeah, I guess a hack. He did kill ten guys. Now it's time to get payback. <laughs> it's payback time. Although, unfortunately, he can't double just yet. Yeah, my ass is itchy. God damn it. Do we really need to know that? <laughs> well, hopefully he gets speed. See, even Soren can get speed level ups. Come on, Slow Kaya, learn from that. He's gonna max out most of his stats. And look at Khalil, she already maxes out speed. Yeah, look at her and her smug face. Which I'm really more than happy to see, actually. Well, yeah, especially because we didn't have her in Path of Radiance. Because we somehow missed her. <laughs> I don't know where she was at in that game. Oh, shit, I realized something. Oh, yeah. Okay, well, this bow is not that strong, but we'll see the favors it does. I mean, the range definitely makes up for it, though. It's probably fantastic against flyer units. Has 34 might? Hmm. Interesting. Hopefully she'll get magic. Well, she did. <laughs> and a bunch of other stats, for that matter. Yeah. Well, probably except defense, but she probably doesn't need defense right now. Probably the best defense that I might go for is probably 20. Holy shit, look at Thoron! Thoron! You'll, you'll probably like the animation. Let's see what you can do, Ileana. Oh my god! <laughs> wow, that was way cooler than it is in Smash. What the hell? Yo, that animation is really crazy. Alright, that's one point for Radiant Dawn and zero points for Smash. <laughs> I 
Titania is literally this close to maxing out most of her most of her freaking stats. <laughs> All right, I'll be back. I think my fries are done. Okay. Not that it would matter. Well, she she got a bad start. Holy shit, that silver blade is really heavy. Well, I guess I have to wait for Jacob. Ooh, I like what I'm seeing. More Khalil. And... Aw, Titania being adorable. How cute. <laughs> this is amazing. This is just... <sighs> this is amazing. I'm just so happy of what I'm seeing. Still no word from the battle. What's going on out there? I should go to my people. They need me. Hey, just where do you think you're going? You think the high and mighty apostle should be... Tr tr ...trasping around a battlefield, hmm? Oh, it's you. How dare you sneak up on me that way? The beauty from the holy guards told me to keep an eye on... On you. So, Liliana had 99 XP? Oh. Do me a favor and sit still, will you? But I can't see anything from here. I have to know how my people are faring down there. I can't bear to doing nothing. I have an idea. You, carry me to a place where I can observe the battle. Don't give me that look. You're the one agree who agreed to guard me. So do your duty and obey your orders. Come on, let's get moving. Wait a minute, is that what passes for Barak logic these days? No wonder you've lost your throne. Ow, stop! Are you going to obey me or shall I have you chase back home in a cloud of feathers? <laughs> oh shit, oh shit, it's Nutella, what the fuck is he doing? I don't even know, but this is great! <laughs> By the goddess, what have I gotten myself into? As you wish, Empress, my back is yours. Okay. okay. I didn't. I didn't expect Nutella to join. On an unexpected Nutella appearance. But honestly, this is. You know, Jacob. This, how can this get any better? How can this get any better? Peak Effie right here. 
Big Effie at its finest. <laughs> yep. Man, Marcy is really this low on strength. Well, I mean, he is the crit queen. Well, I'll still have time to give her more EXP. I'll speed up. Yeah, well, I have my quote unquote dinner. And what dinner is that? Chips? Yes, actually. I have better- I had better dinners, you know. <laughs> oh, is they called Titanic? You really know. Yeah, what's wrong with that? I mean, I'd say she's more hot than cute, but I won't judge. Well... Zeppi just sent me a wholesome image of Titania. Oh. So that's how we, uh, that's how you kept things interesting while I was gone. Yeah. Well, it's a good thing I don't have to pause, then. <laughs> yeah, I guess so. At this point, I might not get that much EXP. Uh-oh! What, what the hell? What is happening? Oh, that was after killing 20 units. I think that was I think that was Luan like passing out or something from the emblem being too strong. I mean that every every time we kill we get a scene. Pretty like much. It's just number. Every ten units it looks like. <laughs> I didn't mean I didn't mean to push that button. <laughs> Luan died. <laughs> Damn. That's awful. <laughs> well, Jose, you got to reset now. <laughs> okay, I'll, I'll accept that. At this point, she might max out defense. Good on you, Marcia. Hey, Jacob, you want to see? You want to see the saddest death ever? What? <laughs> <laughs> this is. This is incredibly sad, Jacob. I could literally one-shot Fiona. <laughs> With Braum. <laughs> yeah, ye Yeah, this is literally the most depressing death I've ever seen. <laughs> one-shot! You know, Jacob, that should be the highlight. What power? It says that they have the might of the Dark God on their side. I cannot continue this fight. Yeah, bye. Oh, no. Bye, oh, Fiona. No you won't. You won't be missed. Exactly. You won't be missed. <laughs> I mean, the music at least loops. It doesn't loop properly, but it at least loops. <laughs> at least that's good. So it doesn't go completely silent. Well, shit, she got... she got soul. Unnecessary soul. But hey, I'm happy. <laughs> 20 defense in a falcon knife. Fake fire emblem game. Why, what are they supposed <laughs> to have? She's supposed to have more res, I think. Oh. But oh well. I'm it's still better than nothing, I guess. Oh, <laughs> oh <laughs> yes! I get more range out of this. Oh, he's yeah. gonna crit! Come on, please crit! And he's not gonna crit! How dare you! Boo! I thought you were cool, Sh friggin' Shinin. Shinin, more like shitin. <laughs> shitin. <laughs> Man, would you fight with me? 
It'll give us a tactical advantage. Ooh, I'd like to play that plan. If we play to each other's strengths, the enemy won't know what hit him. <laughs> See, the thing about Soren is he's not chummy with his fellow with his fellow um, army members. Instead, he just takes advantage of them to try and get a better advantage in the battle. <laughs> True. All right, Jay, if you want to see the advantages of the freaking silver sword, sure. You get a 100% accuracy, but low, uh, a freaking low hit. Well, look at silver blade. It does four more damage. Yeah. I mean, I will. I mean. In the last battle, I did get really low hit rate. Yeah, obviously you don't want that. I like but to hey. I like to play that plan. It <laughs> says Mia, 2024. But hey, at least it can hit harder. Well, Mia's gonna make me hard if you know what I mean. Idiot. <laughs> or as Biff said, butthead. Hmm. Body feels like it's on fire. I can hardly breathe. But this is what war feels like? No, please don't come near me. I don't want to hurt anyone. Oh, that's at 25 units killed. Well, Jacob, you actually got it right. Told ya. Same with Nyla. Like, the only way I would kill Nyla is to get Heather there, to mm -hmm. get a lucky Bane. Like, I have to get a really lucky Bane. Mine has used math. Yeah, I know. It's pretty powerful, right? Brom, I, um, I like you a lot. You know this. I, I think, so, so please, don't be, be dying. Well, I can't argue with you like that. I'd surely like to drink and laugh with you when all of this is over. Well, at least they will protect each other. Again, name a better duo in any game. <laughs> in my playthrough, I just... I just put together with... <laughs> you put Nephany and Heather together? Yeah. New S support. It should be an S support. What do you mean? <laughs> All right, Eliana. Let's see what you've got. Let's see what you got. Well, the good thing is that I have more concussion. Well, you can't spell concoction without cock. Idiot. <laughs> <laughs> that literally does nothing. Lol, bozo. That's not funny? Aww. See, even Zeppi agrees with me. Nobody can damage friggin' Nephany! Imagine, imagine how much more lame this would be if it wasn't the, the voted. Yeah, I could imagine how lame it would be. Yeah. <laughs> oh, you're not agreeing? Okay. Well, okay. I think we'll get another scene at 30 units. Yeah. Oh, shit! <laughs> something, something. Wait, I'm coming. I'll be right there. Aya, what's wrong? Oh, her bird up flew away. She left? She's she straight up left! <laughs> <laughs> 
Micaiah le mid Micaiah leaves because she knows she's too slow. Anyways, now would be a good time to go wash the dishes, so I'll be right back. Okay. Wait, what? Why is she here? Uh, okay. What? I... I don't know what to say, honestly. But I'll, I'll just leave it at that. This is news to me. Anyways, guys, you'll never guess what. what? I went to, I went to Walmart today and they didn't have any fucking water enhancers. So I have to go tomorrow and see if they have any. What are and you trying to get that? And if, they, if Walmart doesn't have any water enhancers, then I'm gonna go to Superstore and get them. <laughs> Which is a longer walk, but... Yeah. You wanna see the rank of the friggin' Thoron? It's S, S rank. Yeah, what's so special about that? It's literally one- it's literally the second highest thunder magic. Yeah, maybe get her to SS rank next. She will, eventually. But Jacob, you you won't believe who joined in the party. What, Anna? Yep. I saw her join like just as I left. <laughs> but she's still fucking terrible. <laughs> Great. Makaya rage quitting due to her being slow, so she walked out of the fight. <laughs> That's really funny, actually. Yeah, she's too slow to even run. She just walks. She even she knows how terrible she is. This this entire series is just the Makaya slander. But then me also secretly looking up Makaya swimsuit art behind her back. Why, because she's hot? Yeah. Understandable. She is, um... She is quite honestly the epitome of dumb blonde. Except she's, you know... Yeah, silver hair. Whatever whatever you call her. Dumb, dumb silver? I don't know. She's really, um, she's really dumb, but boy, is she hot. <laughs> that could be the case with many things. Yep. But oh well. That's not what we're here to talk about. I mean, we have a couple. We, I mean, we do have a couple of blondes on our team, but they're far from dumb. I mean, literally, Heather is a blonde, but she is vicious towards anybody. Sure, yeah. she may be weak, but she has Bane. And boobs. And Bane. And Chris. <laughs> I know. Well, honestly, this is a good start for Ileana since she leveled up magic. Good on you, Ileana. Oh, she's an Arch Sage now. That's right. Basically, like I said, she is a higher Sage. And what is the spear even going to do? <laughs> I tell you what, it's going to it's gonna do nothing. Because I have Bane. You are fucking dead. Oh, I'm going to walk over there. Come on, coming. I'm coming. Dumbass. Seriously, I love Heather so much. <laughs> I, think that's the I think you love her for the same reason people love Yunaka. Or, well, at least similar reasons. You know, just a hot, a hot, super useful, you know, assassin lady. Yeah. And she's close to maxing out.
friggin' skill. <laughs> Hopefully she gets that next level up. She is gonna be the... She might... She literally might be the first Fire Emblem character to max out all of her... All stats. Uh, besides Coke Chan. <laughs> yeah, besides her. Besides from a sandbox game. Yep. Dead. <laughs> See how it feels like to kill both Sorlil? Now this. Now this is what it's like. <laughs> Zeppi said, "Fuck you." <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> I'm guessing in response to. Yeah. Wait, two sandbox games. Wait, what's that? What? What? What do you? Oh, he played um. What do you mean by two sandbox games? Sandbox games like Fire Emblem Awakening, Fates. Oh. They they are sandbox games. If you by you know building up all the characters easily. I see. I'm just not. I'm just not insulting them. It's just. I'm saying that uh, Heather is. If, I'm just saying that Heather is going to be the first character to max out all her stats. In, in other words, he's saying, "Don't be a hypocrite." Did he call me a hypocrite? Well, now he did. <laughs> just about now. Now he said, "Stop being a hypocrite." Probably because I brought it up. Well, you did. I mean, Jacob, do you... I mean, Jacob, do you hear me say something hypocritical? Mmm... No, but I'll call you out if you do. <laughs> See? But I don't know, I don't really... I'm not very good at detecting hypocrisy anyway. Okay. Well, like I said, I didn't even insult Awakening nor Fades. Here comes Marcia! I'm always happy to see Marcia. Here comes Johnny. Here's Johnny. Now who needs some healing? <laughs> here comes Shinnin. <laughs> yep, here comes Shinnin. Bam, <laughs> And I'm not even going to... Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Jose, you're, Jose, you're dying! You're entered as dying! Anyways, check this sauce out. Ooga. Guys, Jose's entered as dying on him. He's dying, guys. Call the police department. Call it. Call an ambulance. He just said, Call an ambulance. <laughs> Wait, well, he's dying. I... He's dying. The IP, the I, the ISP got him. <laughs> oh no. He's still on my parsec, though. But yeah, I think uh, his internet's having a stroke. There you go. You good now? Why does this happen? Why? Beats me. Jacob, can you hear me well? Now I can. Hey, actually, I have Jacob, a. I, I actually have I a. I can literally barely hear you. I thought you stopped talking. You know what? I have a better idea. 
Why don't we take like we're gonna? How about we take like what a? Idea do you have? Let's take like a five or ten minute break so your internet can sort out. Cause I have to use the bathroom anyway, and I don't want to, you know, you know, not commentate for like five minutes. So I think this will probably hey, be for the best. Tell me you can hear me. I can hear you. I'm just gonna like give your internet some time to sort itself out, though. So I'll be back, and we Jacob, and we can take a break. How about that? Jacob, please tell me you can hear me well. All right. Anyways, um, guys, Jacob. welcome back. I had a break because uh, I wasn't, I wasn't, I, I wasn't feeling that well. <laughs> but don't worry, guys. The ISP hasn't raped me. <laughs> Thank God. It was just Discord being drunk. <laughs> Nothing to worry yeah. about. It was Discord being drunk again. Yep. Anyways, yeah, um, honestly, I wouldn't mind taking breaks more often in these streams. But yeah, why would you say that, uh, freaking Discord is drunk again? Again? Um, it, it's, it's done that before, where sometimes the connection just gets, like, all poopy for no reason. Ah. Uh. Yeah, poopy. <laughs> yeah, poopy, because I was in the bathroom. <laughs> Nephany! The girl, Nephany! Yeah, thighs. Anyways, I, I I was uh I was listening to your guys' conversation while I was in the bathroom to keep myself from not being bored. All I all all I heard was um all I really remember is um three houses has stupid caps. <laughs> yeah, their caps are really high. Like I said, they can range from seventy to one hundred. Yeah. It's literally not a good game mechanic. You were just better off. Wait, what is he doing? Oh no! Did he? Oh, oh no, he's sleeping. He has a he has a sleep spell. Yes. That's a new one. Mm. Okay, now that mage has to go. Bye, mage. Yeah, what are you gonna do? What are you gonna do, Edward? Yeah, you suck. You, I haven't even leveled you up very much. Exactly. Nobody leveled that weirdo up. <laughs> Nemo, we, we, leveled up about... a, we level up Nephany a shit ton. Yeah, we level up Nephany just because she's hot. Yep. I mean, if you check my pics, if I have a few more pieces of Nephany sauce on there. Which I'm happy. Yeah. Send some of it to Jose, uh, Zeppi. <laughs> okay. Oh no, that kitty died. Oh no. Anyway. Well, at least. Well, at least the freaking army is about to go down. Yeah. Honestly, I think for next Radiant Dawn stream, I think maybe we should take a break, like, after every chapter. Sure, we can do that. Because taking, like, a five minute break after a chapter would really boost my endurance. And it would yeah. allow me to not get tired so easily. I can help. Yeah. <laughs> Ike is sleeping. You see that one per you see You see that one damage? Oh, I wasn't paying attention to the one damage. I thought you were laughing at the fact that Ike's asleep. <laughs> I'm laughing at the fact that he literally took one damage. <laughs> that is the funny part. Oh, okay. I mean, sure, you could say that Ike is sleeping is kind of funny, but the one damage is even funnier while he's sleeping. I mean, to be fair, Ike does also sleep in Smash Bros, so that's kind of funny. That is. Oh, we have to fight Trevor. Or, I mean, Nolan. Oh, well, he landed a hit. You know what? I'm gonna call him Trevor now. <laughs> that's his Trevor new name. G what, you mean Trevor from GTA? No. <laughs> okay, so... I saw his axe name. His axe name is Tarvos, and I read that as Trevor, and I was like, oh yeah, his name's Trevor. <laughs> <laughs> sure, you can just call him Trevor. <laughs> like, I just hate like, the fact that Trevor- Like Trevor uh, Belmont. You know, I just hate the fact that freaking Trevor just landed a hit. How could you, Trevor? And for that, you must die. You're gonna die by the freaking- Die, monster. Uh, but yeah, you're gonna die by the freaking Death Queen. You know, you know what I'm laughing at in my head right now? What? Richter's sleep voice line from Smash Ultimate. <laughs> what? Because he's just like, uh, mm, Dracula. <laughs> he's dreaming about Dracula? <laughs> yeah. 
<laughs> that, okay, that's funny. That's not why I'm laughing at it, though. The, re the thing I'm laughing about is the fact that it gets cut off in-game for some reason. <laughs> so, f for those of you who don't know, this is like a stupid bit of Smash Ultimate trivia, but Richter's sleeping line gets cut off at the end before it fully loops properly. The, 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 like, the localization team fucked up there. And instead, instead of going, mmm, Dracula, he just goes, mmm... It just goes, uh, mm, drag, and then it just cuts off and it resets to the start. Oh That's stupid. <laughs> I don't know why I'm laughing about that. They got superior numbers on their side. Sorry, Micaiah. I'm retreating for now. Well, bye bye, Trevor. <laughs> <laughs> Well, Mommy Titania to the rescue. Hello, yes. we're almost near part four and we're still coming up with new stupid names like Trevor. <laughs> Fantastic. I, I think, I'm pretty sure I got that from, uh, what's his name? That Jigglypuff guy. I forgot his name. P. Jiggles. P. Jiggles, yeah. I got that, if, I got that from P. Jiggles. From one of his, really from one of his useless Smash Fact videos, and I always found that real that moment that really that one really funny. Why do you even care about freaking Smash Facts? It's it's brain rot. <laughs> That's why. Well, no dir. Yep. Everything that's facts related is just I don't know brain rot. Yeah. You know what's even worse than brain rot, though? What? Nathaniel Bandy's content. <laughs> <laughs> Nathaniel Bandy's content. <laughs> sorry, I had to. I I I sorry to bring it up like every episode. <laughs> That's okay. Sometimes I wonder if if we're being legitimate or if it's just a stupid bit. It might be a stupid bit. We it's, just it, hate the. We just hate Nathaniel Mandy. Well, I don't always hate him. I just think most of his contents kind of miss. Okay, well, <laughs> okay, well, you know what, Jacob? Let's just say this: Nathaniel Mandy is not a bad person. He's I not. Say that. He's not a bad person. I think he, you know, he can do good stuff. But I just think most of his content these days is miss. You know, I. I you, you could say all the shitty things about the anger video game nerd you want, but at least most of the AVGN episodes recently have been good, as well. There's only like exactly. a there's only a couple that I think were generally just like meh. Oh, what about the obscure one that happened recently? Which one? The freaking horse episode. Oh yeah, I never I didn't even watch that. <laughs> well, let's just say it's a really bizarre episode. If you do that, you are a bad person. <laughs> I remember that. <laughs> well, Brom to the rescue. Yeah, Brom. Aw, oh, shit. I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> I just shoved him. He shoved Ike. That. Well, how come shoving doesn't wake him up? You think you think a big shove by a big, ni big nice guy like Brom would wake Ike up? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, that's satisfying. Yeah, Impale is literally one of the more satisfying moves. If the Thaniel Bandy makes mid content, Nico BBQ is like his um his his mid his mid hit Spanish cousin that also does the same thing. Where's Snoop Dogg and Byleth gone? Fuck. <laughs> Jacob, he's Canadian. Oh yeah, he I know, but he he has like a very funny accent. I can't imagine why <laughs> his accent would be funny. Yeah, but I'm uh, pretty sure one of his recent videos was like, I can't remember if it was Nathaniel Bandy or Nico BBQ because their fucking content just keeps blending together. Honestly, like it feels like they're just oh, bye Edward. <laughs> bye Edward. Nobody cares about you. <laughs> Like, I think one of the recent videos was like, can I beat Mario without touching colors? And I'm like, bro, come up with well, something, I... come up with something better. <laughs> At least make a really tough challenge that's noteworthy. 
Yeah, but like, people, I, I, I'm so sick of all these challenges that people come up with. Like, they really run out of ideas. Like, can I beat this game without touching colors? Can I beat, beat this game without touching bricks? Can you I? You know what's cool? You want to know what's a cool challenge? A one man army run. Yeah. Without touching that colors. Yeah, I know. I'm no, like, I'm ser no, I'm serious. Go to their videos. You don't believe me, Zappy? Go to their video. Go like, to their channels. Oh, like, look, Jacob. If you do a one-man army, you can earn people's respect for what you're doing. Yeah, that's that's noteworthy. It um, is. YouTube is that's dying. Why, you know, Jacob. That's why I am intentionally going to do a one-man army run in Persona Three Fes. Good on you. Just what? to show how much. Just to show how much of a badass I am. Oh, what are you gonna do? Is that short axe gonna hit me? Nope. And no, it didn't. Fuck you. <laughs> you do not mess with Sigrun. And while that's happening, we got more sauce from the Zepmeister. Hold on. I know that, Art. He sent me that a few minutes ago. Ooh, I like that, though. Congrats for first place. Queen... Friggin' Queen Micaiah. Queen Micaiah. She's the queen of good looks, but not the queen of, um, battle. <laughs> or queen of speed, yeah. She is not a speed queen. She is a slow queen, mid queen. You know what I, you know what I guess you could call her? You can call her lightning mid queen. Great, <laughs> <laughs> that's not original. <laughs> Realistic FE, no music. <laughs> Too realistic, in fact. Well, I don't care. I'm, I'm just getting, I'm just getting more EXP. 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 You want to know what's the weirdest thing that Sony has ever made for PlayStation? <laughs> what? Also, Zeppi found it, it funny. Wow, crazy. Uh, PlayStation literally made a phone-based console. I think that sounds familiar. What it, was it called again? It, it's called the PlayStation Phone, as people called it. <laughs> the PlayStation Phone. I'm not even joking. That's a real thing. Just search it up for yourself. Is that what they released? Is that is that what they released? Um, the Persona One porn on? No. Or the, there was like there was like I'm some there there was like some version of Persona One for phones. And I wonder no, if it was I'm made serious. for that. No, I'm serious, Jacob. Just look it up. It's it's a real thing. Was it called the PlayStation Phone? Yeah, that's what it's simply called. It's called the PlayStation Phone. PlayStation Phone Games. There we go. Not games, it's just phone. Yeah, because I look up PlayStation Phone Games and Jackbox pops up for some reason. Just type in PlayStation Phone and that's it. The Xperia Play? Yes, that's what it's literally called. Okay, that that makes it easier. All right, Xperia, Xperia play games. There we go. People just don't like the name and just call it the PlayStation Phone. It's much easier. Complete list of Xperia play optimized games. Um, any noteworthy ones? Uh, let's see. Asphalt 6, Backstab, Battlefield, Bad Company 2, Bruce Lee, Dragon Warrior, Crash Bandicoot, Dead Space, Dungeon Defenders, FIFA 10, Game Loft Live, Guitar Hero, Gun Bros, Madden, Minecraft Pocket Edition, Need for Speed Hot Pursuit, Reckless Racing, Samurai 2, Star Battalion 2, or Star Battalion HD, Spider-Man Total Mayhem, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, Rooftop Runner, and Worms HD. Interesting. Like, what, like, what the fuck are these games? Goofy ad games. See what I mean, Jacob? The PlayStation phone actually existed before. Which, just Hot Pursuit 1. Was on- the Hot Pursuit was on a PlayStation hybrid mobile phone. Don't you find this bizarre that they made a freaking phone-based console? I mean, this is not the first time we've heard honestly, a phone -based honestly, console. it's the, it's the first I'm hearing of it. 
Not the 2010 version? I think it might be the 2010 version because... Wait, hang on, no. No, it's not. Because the Xperia came out in 2011. Wait, no, yeah, maybe it could be the 2010 version. If it came out in 2011. I mean, it is the decade after all that it's we possible. used to live in. Oh, yeah. Wait, Zappy, didn't they make two versions of Need for Speed? Like, one at the start of the Xbox's life and one at the end of the Xbox's life? I heard about that in a Scott the Waz video recently. And I'm yeah, like, and I'm like, what? Yeah, like, what? That's kind of wild. Well, I know, I know, he, I know, I know, Zeppi, I know Zeppi's kind of a fan of Need for Speed, so <laughs> he knows about that stuff. I actually wasn't even aware of that. Yeah, cause huh. I don't, I don't own it. Neither do I, but okay. <sighs> I, I can't. Jacob, you also gotta realize this, that that the freaking PlayStation wasn't the only company who thought of a phone phone-based game. You know who else made a phone-based game? Who? The Nokia. Yeah, then are you talking about the Nokia N-Gage? Yep. <laughs> I remember That's that. I, mean. I remember that. The AVGN reviewed that. Yeah, I know. He also reviewed a funny little console called the GameCom. <laughs> Whatever that is. It's like... It's like a calculator... Slash... Game console slash... Computer... Thing. You know, Jacob, I found <laughs> a calculator that can play Doom. Oh yeah, that's cool. Did you know calculators can also play Duke Nukem? <laughs> no. <laughs> yeah, you can play- you can play Duke Nukem on a calculator. You know, it's kind of cool that calculators can play games. Mm-hmm. Jose missed the opportunity for what? I blame Twitch delay, because I'm not gonna- <laughs> I'm gonna be asking that a lot. Of what? Need for Speed? I don't know. Brom killing Meg? Oh, shit! <laughs> That's so fucked up, but yeah. Okay, you know what? <laughs> yeah, that's a missed opportunity, even though it's fucked up. I only... <laughs> I only used friggin' Shinnin because he is at 99 EXP, and I leveled up. <laughs> leave it to Pat... Leave it, leave it to Radiant Dawn, where it's the only game you can kill your own daughter. <laughs> it's fucked up, but it's funny. I mean, also, I mean, I mean, a lot of in a lot of Fire Emblem games, you can kill your own father. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, that can happen. I mean, for example, you kill your father in the end of Engage. <laughs> well, what's even funnier is that sometimes fathers can be burned to a crisp. Yep. And I'm not gonna spoil or what game that happened. It's well, it, it's all a, it's I a... all I know is I like crisps. All, all I can say is that it's a fam it's a famous scene, or at least an infamous scene that everybody knows in the community. Which game? I'm not gonna tell you where it is. It's gonna be also a surprise. Oh, I see. Yeah. Keeps it as fresh although as possible. Zeppi might, although Zeppi might tell you. Fuck. <laughs> oh, that was the best fuck I've ever heard. <laughs> Okay, so you got, so Zeppi knows what you're talking about. I think Zeppi might tell you what it might be. Yeah, he'll probably keep it a surprise as well. Just hope for the best. Gotta heal the crit queen. Yeah. 60, yeah, but... 60 kills, guys. But I will say, tell you this, that that moment will affect the game. Oh boy. Entirely because... Yeah. You'll be shocked and be upset. Just saying. Burn up, burn up. Right now, we're gonna have Soren adept. You know, he doesn't need to adept. Exactly. He doesn't even need to adept. 
By the way, I was watching some really random shit last night. Oh no! Oh boy. <laughs> now I have to kill Laura. Laura's using her own magic against you. But anyways, I was watching um some B movie scenes last night, <laughs> which is kind of yeah. why I wanted to watch it again. And I was watching um so um well, how how am I gonna say it? Um, you crit. <laughs> nice. Let's just say the part the part where Joe is trying to kill Barry with uh in, in the bathroom. <laughs> And also just like all the other scenes in general. <laughs> I okay. And he got another crit. <laughs> he got another crit. And it's just really funny because the comments are just saying like Bro Bro's literally the only sane guy in the whole movie. His his wife was trying to fuck a bee. <laughs> Oh my god, that is- awful. How does that even work? How the fuck does that even work? Bees are so small! I know. But like, the, <laughs> like I, I, I watched the bee movie as a kid, but now that I'm older and like understand things, like, I'm like, bro, this, this movie was literally about a woman trying to, you know, like, get it on with a fucking bee and cheat on his- cheat on her husband with a bee. <laughs> How the fuck does that even work? It's not even legal. Yeah, and then, and then at the end of the movie, there's a fucking court scene about bees and humanity, and how the bees are trying to sue the human race or something. <laughs> and I'm like, I'm just, like, and, and I'm just like, man, the bee movie sure is wild. How did I not understand any of this as a kid? <laughs> oh, look, at times the bee movie can be dark. Yeah. Like, it's literally like a freaking WTF catastrophe. But that's why I love it, because they got they got Patrick Warburton and Jerry Seinfeld in it. That's like, you know, perfection right there. And also, uh, I forgot his name, but the guy who plays Soli from Monsters, Inc. is the voice of the lawyer. <laughs> okay, that... That has many surprises. <laughs> you like jazz? I mean, who doesn't? Yeah, and um, also another thing I watched last night was I watched a really stupid video called Every Innuendo in Shrek. <laughs> I mean, Jacob, Shrek literally had adult jokes. Yeah, so the video is just called Every Adult Sh Joke in the Shrek series, and <laughs> it was pretty. that was also a pretty fun thing to watch. There's literally, there's literally a part where the Lord Farquaad gets a boner. <laughs> okay, yeah, I actually... Yeah, even I knew that happened. I did I not remember that at all. I actually did remember that a few years earlier since I actually did realize the joke. I gotta rewatch the Shrek movies now. Jeez. Yeah, you, sh yeah, you should watch all the Shrek movies. So some guy said Shrek is funnier the older you get. <laughs> and he's probably right about that. Mm-hmm. There's also another there there's no also another scene I saw where what? Puss in Boots he gets like arrested and he some guy pulls out like a bag of catnip but it looks like a bag of cocaine. <laughs> it's basically a drug reference. Yeah, which is also funny. It is funny. Also wait, check che also... check out check me a speed. And it's also kind of a reference to something that happened years ago in real life. Uh, That's crazy. Of Spanish people in of Spanish people in America smuggling drugs. Oh, oh, she, oh, she's she's definitely getting up there on speed though. She's got thirty five now. Yeah, but she's she is gonna be stronger than friggin' Heather. I will say that. <laughs> yeah, Heather is the speed queen. <laughs> she's gonna kill anyways. She's gonna be lightning McSpeed. <laughs> <laughs> Oh yeah, and Zeppi said something just to know whoever did it. They didn't do anything wrong. <laughs> they didn't do anything wrong. All right, Jose. All right, all right, Jose. One more kill. I'm, I was honestly, I was about to freaking counter that response to say, even if he didn't do anything wrong, he did committed a lot of horrible things, like plotting and scheming, all the way to the throne. Oh boy. 
All right, one more kill, Jose. <laughs> and let's just say that, well, let's just say the word cucked. I will say that. Bro committed NTR? Crazy. Yeah, that's crazy. All right, look at the number. <laughs> <laughs> yep, I see the number. <laughs> I knew you were about to mention that, though. Yep. I know you're proud of that joke, I, I know. Mm -hmm. But, you know what? Who cares? I certainly don't care. Nobody cares! <laughs> nobody cares! Do you know why nobody cares? Perfect. <laughs> Clip it. <laughs> Clip it. Clip what? Also, um, you know, you know, you know, be a really funny uh thing to do, Jose. Oh yeah, clip, clip sixty nine. Oh, clip sixty nine. Yeah, sure. You know, you know, you know how you're playing every Charles Martinet game. Yeah, I'm you know, play every single Charles Martinet game. You know what else you should do? Besides oh. that, you should watch every Jim Carrey movie. <laughs> you know what? Sure, I'll do that. <laughs> <laughs> Laura keeps doing this. Which means, keep... which, which means you have to watch. You have to watch The Grinch. Yeah. And um. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Mr. Van Driesen. Mr. Van Driesen. No, Mr. Van Driesen. No, Mr. Van Driesen. Oh. Why? What have I done? And now it says 60, rip. <sighs> it's at 60. What did I do to deserve this? Why? Poor Mr. Van Driesen. And also, it's finally gonna be cooling off for a few days starting Thursday. It's gonna be. 22 degrees for a few days, and then it's gonna go back up to 28 next Sunday. Any adept again? Yeah, I'm guessing that's predetermined. Maybe, but I'm not sure just yet. Oh, yeah, anyways, guys, I got paid by YouTube today, so I can afford a few more groceries than usual <laughs> this month. Oh, that's nice. Yeah. Mostly gonna be using it in emer in case of emergency, though. Like, if I run out of that's, money. That's understandable. Now it's time for me to be even more careful. Oh, and I also told you about my, uh, my quest to, to eat all the Tim Hortons donuts. <laughs> yeah. I remember you saying that. Yeah, I try, like, one donut every few days. And how did that go? Well, I mean, you wouldn't know anything about Tim Hortons because it's a Canadian coffee shop. I know that. But, um, also Sigrun Slang. She got a good level up? Yep. But, uh, let's see. So, the first time I went to Timmy's, I got a duchy. Now, if you guys don't know what a duchy is, it's a, a sugary icing kind of sticky donut with raisins. I know it's not everybody. You know, not everybody's cup of tea, but I like it. You know, Jacob, I was about to make a joke. What? A really unfunny joke when you said a duchy. A dutch? Oh. <laughs> well, you're gonna say a dachi? <laughs> yes. You know what? I didn't even see that one coming. So good. We have Tim's horn. It's just, it just keeps closing. Oh. oh boom. Well, Jacob, she didn't. Uh, she didn't level up strength this time, but at least she levels Rip. up everything else. I don't like how we close all the targets over here. <laughs> you guys are closing Tim Horns, we we close all our targets. So you know what it balances out. It just makes me sad that the places that are in the US are closing down. Yeah. Too bad nothing can coexist. Yeah. Alright, and then the next just... the next time I went to Timmy's, I got the blueberry sour cream glazed. Which is kind of like a fritter. Except it's got blueberry and sour cream in it. I also realized that Heather doing a freaking Bane was unnecessary. <laughs> Very. 
And then the third time I went, I got something called the Walnut Crunch, which is basically just a chocolate donut, but with walnuts inside. Pretty good. I like chocolate donuts. Do you like walnuts? <laughs> yeah. So you'd probably like that. And then when I went today, I got something called the Sugar Twist, which is um, very mid, honestly. It's just a, it was just a boring, bland donut covered in sugar. It was really dumb. I, I didn't like it. I don't know why they, they, they sell that, but yeah. Yeah, blueberry blueberry with like the taste of sour cream. It's pretty good. No. I like blueberry. No, 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 not cream cheese, sour cream. <laughs> I, know, I like blueberry donuts. Yeah, it's a blueberry donut and with like kind of the taste of um, sour cream in it. Kinda like how they have blueberry. kinda like how they have uh, sour cream glazed, if you guys know what that is. I've heard about it. Yeah. It's good. Don't worry. It, even though it sounds gross, it's actually pretty good. <laughs> Shitty I flavor. You, Jacob. I, I'm not joking. I do believe you, what you say. Well, Zeppi disagrees, but yeah. Anyways, there's a few others that I want to try. Because, like, I've tried all the classic donuts countless times, but I want to try some of the ones I've never had. Like, they also have a caramel donut, which is pretty good. You know, Jacob, you know, Jacob on today, I literally request my dad to find me some jalapeno some freaking jalapeno like cream cheese with bagels yo based i wish i could find that shit because they stopped selling it and uh yeah i i'm just i'm just listening to your request and i want to do that <laughs> get everything bagels yeah good idea Maybe I didn't tell my dad about this. He's gonna give me sesame seed bagels. Yeah, yeah, that's good enough. Yeah, as long as it's not like the plain kind, you'll be fine. Yeah, at least sesame seed is unique. I get sesame seed if they don't have everything bagels. But they usually yeah. have it. Maybe I'll ask my father to get me the everything bagel. I think yeah. I've tried it before. Oh, well, they're the best. But... I don't know. Well, here's, here, well, and here's a pro tip, guys. If you can't get um, jalapeno cream cheese, what you can do is you can chop up some actual jalapeno, put it in the cream cheese, and then put it on the bagel, and problem solved. <laughs> That's what I did one time, and it was really fucking good. It was it, it was just like having jalapeno cream cheese. I just enjoy, Jacob. I I just enjoy jalapenos in general. Yeah, was you, like, yeah, you convinced me to buy a pack of them, and I still have them. <laughs> I bought them like a month ago. You actually listen to my advice and say that hello just because I said the jalapenos are really delicious? Yeah, I, I decided to buy them. Also because they were out of red pepper, so I decided, yeah, well, they don't have red pepper, so I'm gonna buy jalapeno instead. And I've been enjoying them a lot. I've been putting them in my wraps, in my soup, um, in pretty much everything, honestly. <laughs> Maybe it's because I'm really this Hispanic that I in Hispanic that I really enjoy jalapenos so much. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Well, I, I put I put jalapenos in three things. I put them in my pasta. I put them in my wraps, and I put them in my hot dogs. <laughs> Interesting. And they're all, it's all pretty good. I because just enjoy my Jacob. I just enjoy my hot dogs with. Freaking onions, chili cheese. Mmm. Stuff. That's why I. That's why. That's what I enjoy my hot dogs for. Yeah, I. I, I make some of the best damn hot dogs. Like I um, I put mustard, ketchup. Um, Yo, Jacob, you better invite me to your house so I can just have a piece <laughs> of that. Yeah, have have some have some of my hot dogs. How long oh, have been in this chapter? I don't know, like an hour or more, probably. I took, uh, a, I took like a 10 minute break, so I lost track. But we're getting uh, there. Who cares, Jacob? We are gonna finish. I'm having a good time. I'm just talking about shit, because time flies when I when I talk about random BS and I yap for like hours on end. That's okay, Jacob. I also talk about random BS stuff. Yep. Pro tip, guys. If you want time to pass, just yap. <laughs> yeah, yapperin. Anyway, I think Zeppi sent more sauce. Ooh, who's this? Who's this lovely little lady? I think that's Hilda. Hmm. That's Hilda from Three Houses. She's looking a little different these days. 
Yeah, Zevi might say that I might that I'm right that it is Hilda. Well, I like Hilda, so I won't complain. Who is wearing a dark mage outfit from Fates? And I think I know who who it is from. No wonder it looks so familiar. I might know who it is actually. It's probably from Fates. Is it Tharia? No. No. I don't know then. Oh, go to sleep, Ranulf. It's a character named Ophelia. Huh. Well, I kind of have a philia for her, if you get what I mean. Sorry, bad joke. <laughs> See? Zeppi said it as well. Da -na -na -na. Imagine she gets Bane. <laughs> That'd be so I'll funny. It would do no damage. No nut damage? <laughs> no nut November damage. Guys, what are you gonna do? Guys, you know guys, you know what a harder challenge is than no nut November? No nep November. Oh well, that's easy. No it's nep actually easy. No Neptunia for one month. Oh Wait, shit. What? Blizzard? Wait. Oh no, they're they're Me jumping meteor? on Meteor? That's Meteor, right? Yeah. <laughs> they're they're gonna jump on Shinnin. Hey look and it's another guy you don't care about. Yeah, I really don't. Well just cause Shinnin's got the goods? Uh oh. Uh oh. Jill versus Marcia, classic. Who care who I have to fight? I'll fight until the end for the glory of Dane. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no What? She has a brave axe! Oh shit! He, she still she, ha she she still has the brave axe equipped. Yes, I hope she oh. doesn't quad. Oh boy! No, you're fine. I'm not so sure about that. Uh oh. Well, might be fine. Maybe. No. Oh no! no. <laughs> well, good thing he saved. <laughs> What should I do? What should I do? Oh right, I didn't finish my hot dog talk. I was gonna talk about how I put um, garlic, jalapenos, cheese, oregano, mustard, ketchup, and hot sauce on my hot dogs. That's a good. That's a good hot dog right there. It's like some of the like peak hot dog right there, in my opinion. So I make some killer hot dogs, guys. I've gotten really good at it. Now he's asleep. Oh no. Is the same thing gonna happen last time? No. Marcia is dead legit. <laughs> Alright, he's fine. Oh, I don't think Shin is gonna be fine. You take your turn, guys. Yep, take your turns. Yep, do your thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, this looks like a repeat of what happened last time. Oh, oh come on! No! 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 Thank God. I think... See, she lived that time. <laughs> wow, they all took a turn to uh, untransform. Okay. Marcia real... is okay. <laughs> you know, Jacob, the real problem is that I have... I have to save Shinnin. Mm, what are you gonna do, a rescue? I don't have a rescue. Oh, wait a minute. Yeah, sure, that works. <laughs> And then you can have a uh, mist heal them. Oh boy. He only has one more sleep. Oh, you send Boonie? Hold on. I want to see Boonie. Yo! Oh! Ooh. 
Yo, look at, check this shit out. We got some boonies. Lots of good boonies. Oh, damn. Okay, so, let me see. Let me, let me, let me see if I know. Okay, so that's Hilda Aelgard. I think her name is... Who is that? Is that Mercedes? Or is that someone else? Yeah, you're right. Okay. Uh, we got Tharia, um, Tiki, and... We're at Robin, I think. Yeah, that's Robin. Okay. I know my I now know my I want, waifus. Yes. Now I want now I want Tiki. <laughs> Tiki Boonie. Yep. Literally awakening Tiki is the best. Yeah, instead of Lolly Tiki from <laughs> Engage. <laughs> I wish that adult Tiki was in friggin' uh Engage. But she does have a funny voice. Yeah, that's true. Also, I can't believe that friggin' Nephany just missed twice. Damn, Nephany, how could you? How the fuck does that even work? Mm -hmm. Man, uh, Engage really is just the game of lollies, isn't it? <laughs> Unfortunately, yes. I mean, it's got Anna, it's got Tiki, what was her- I don't know what her hit rate is, I wasn't paying attention. Her hit rate was real, literally 92. Ain't no fucking way, that missed twice then, what the hell? Yeah, that's what I'm questioning about, how the- f How the fuck does that even miss? <laughs> you know what, that's- that's basically Zeppi's luck in Link Arena. <laughs> 92 hit right, but manages to miss twice. Okay, now I am in a dire situation. Dragon. Brom gives no fucks. Think. I know. I love how that big ass wyvern ain't ain't able to damage Brom. <laughs> There's something really funny that? about that. She she really can't even damage friggin' uh Brom. Yeah, see, see I told you Brom's the best character. But damn, Jill was a th was was not a was not someone to mess with. Yeah, Jill was a threat this map. The enemy is moving fast. We can't keep them up. Lady Micaiah, I'm afraid I have to pull back immediately. And yeah, you're not missing much. Mid Kai already left. <laughs> Alright, time to kill that guy too. <laughs> I would have stopped playing after that happening. Oh wow. Yeah, very relatable. Not gonna lie, I would as well. Aw, oh, really? 90% hit rate missed? Man, that's like Pokemon, dude. Something has like a 90 not something has like a 98% hit rate, but yet it feels like it misses half the damn time. That's so, just stupid, I will say that. If something isn't a hundred, I don't want it. <laughs> that that is a certified WTF moment. It you know, Jacob, it's an unbelievable moment. Like, anyway, how fucking unbelievable is that? Anyways, to reward you with all of the sauce you've been sending, I'm gonna send you some sauce. <laughs> TBH. And yes, that, that Discord notification was me sending sauce to Jose. <laughs> In case you were wondering. Yeah, okay. That's a welcome to Fire Emblem moment. True. Ooh! Yuka. Yep. Alright, after this little, I'm gonna show you guys. Well, he... Well, well at least... Well, at least he level up defense. <laughs> Mommy! Mommy! Flower mother. Yep, flower mommy. You know, you know, you, oh my god, I just thought of something stupid. 
what? Imagine, imagine if Yuka was Lucas's mom. <laughs> But then... How, how much better Mother 3 would have been off? <laughs> but then you would realize that Yuka would just die. No, she wouldn't. Yuka, Yuka has a fucking, like, umbrella laser. <laughs> Good ass sauce. <laughs> See, yeah, Mike really can't do anything. See, Lucas wouldn't have a dead mother if his mother was just M Yuka. <laughs> Yeah, I would be happy as well. Oh no! Oh no! I... Are you? Why did you freeze, friggin' oh, Mia? No. Poor Mia. All the hits are guaranteed. Mia's getting bullied, guys. She's dead. Fuck you! Fuck you! <laughs> this is gonna be this is gonna be a toughie. Wait, was this was this before or after Jill was killed? <laughs> Laura is so petty. Oh no! Oh, oh, you, oh, you got yeah to kill Jill again. Well, shit. Okay, so how come that guy's 43 hit, but Nephany's 90, 92 missed? You know, your question is as good as mine. So this is gonna play out the same. Shin's gonna get hit twice. Or not. We might not have to rescue him if, if he gets good enough RNG. Oh yeah, and, oh then, and then that guy comes in and just says, "No, no, bro, I'd win." Why don't you just let the units come to you then? It's literally playing out the same way. Yep. I mean, you gotta wake. You gotta wait for Ike to wake up from sleep anyway, right? Yeah, I guess. Yeah, so just get all your you just get all your units in the place then. Okay, this time she missed. You mean she dodged? <laughs> yeah, she dodged. Yep, same thing. Boring, boring turn. Honestly, I should have saved. Okay, at least Marcia's better off this time, though. Yeah, she is better. Still misses, though. Okay, now you can save state, probably. Okay, now it's a better time to save state. Mm -hmm. And Nephany is up there. This better not miss. There we go, that's what should have happened. <laughs> magic. She got magic. Good on her, I guess. Yeah, she doesn't really need magic, Jacob, let's be honest. Yeah. <laughs> but hey, I mean, she maxes out some stats. Good Neff Neff. That's at least good. Oh shit, no! That's not what he meant to do. <laughs> At least this stream, I'm not testing out mods and shit, I'm just enjoying the game. 
But don't worry, Jacob, we are close to finishing. Yep. Super Mario Wonder is on sale. Wow. Too bad I already have. Too bad I already have it. <laughs> Damn! I never thought this would be even worse than the last chapter. Yeah. I would. You'd think that that the last chapter would give you a break, but no. Tekken is having a crossover with Nikes. What? <laughs> Nikes? Oh, and actually, I think that's just the name of the character they're adding. They're not actually adding Nikes to the game. Nice job. This friggin' stinks. Luck is just awful. Yeah, I was thinking about buying, um... I was thinking that, like, with my extra money from YouTube, I was thinking about buying, like, a pound of hamburger or something, whipping up something Why? like that. Why hamburgers? <laughs> Send me that article. Which one? Oh, hold on, let me find it. The Nikes? <laughs> I don't think it's actually Nikes. I'll send it, though. I think it's just a, yeah, I think it's just some guy called Nike. Imagine if Imagine if that was a real <laughs> a freaking real. But I mean it, but I mean it would it would it would be like the craziest crossover, you know, considering Sonic had soap shoes. Yeah, true. I really wish I removed that freaking sleep staff. Hmm, yeah, now it's coming to bite you in the ass. It really is biting me in the ass. Windows 11 strikes again with annoying pop-up. Oh great, more reasons to not update to Windows 11. Yeah, I've been getting that recently. Bro, I will stay on Windows 10 until I, I die, bro. How long will that last? Um, I don't know. I guess we'll see. <laughs> Hopefully it's not too much to ask. Now, I will at least go in a safe distance. <laughs> okay, hold on. Zeppy sent me something funny. He says Tekken 8 flopped, and then he sends this. Ooh, ooh, I he, like what I'm saying. He sends Tiki and, pe and Pepsi. Now I want that. Yeah, I also want that. Okay, the the sauce just does not stop. <laughs> Oh, I got some more sauce I'm gonna send in a minute. Also, what? damn, Eliana, chill. <laughs> she got flare! She literally heals herself up! Hey, that's good timing, actually. Anyways, here's more sauce. We got Bunny Tiki. Oh, yes! The sauce yes, gets better. That is friggin' hot. The sauce awakens, I guess we could say. Yeah, what's that gonna do? Brom can tank it. Brom can fucking tank it, you loser. <laughs> so you can suck my nads. By the way, I got a question for you, Murricans. What is yeah, what what is Prime? <laughs> oh shit, Prime. Yeah. I do not want. You know, Jacob. I do not want to talk about that product. Wait, what's wrong with it? <laughs> Prime is just a freaking high sugary uh, energy drink. A shitty energy drink? <laughs> wow, okay, glad I asked for you guys' opinion. Because it's a drink in Tomodachi Life Enterprise. <laughs> and, and Bob Ross is selling it. I was like, what the fuck is Prime? 
I decided to buy it though, because I want to complete my, you know, food and drink catalog bestiary thing. Okay. By the way, you want to know what else is a drink in Tomodachi Enterprise? What? Olive oil. <laughs> Olive oil? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Why? I don't know, but it's funny. They also got they also got three D Doritos and Goku burgers. Oh, I oh Jacob, I've heard of that. I actually heard of that product actually. What three D Doritos? Yes, I actually heard of that. <laughs> and beat this, yeah. Yeah, beat this is also another drink. I really don't get what that means, but okay. It's uh, another spelling of Pepsi, but it's spelled wrong. Even Pepsi knows what the fuck prime drink is. It's it's well, literally it... what I just said—a crappy yeah. energy drink that. Oh what what? Ike, I need you to come over here. Something's wrong with Mist. Mist, Mist, what's wrong? I think we finished the chapter. Well, yeah, because doesn't Mist get all, like, sensitive to the medallion? Yeah. Ike, my head, it hurts so much. It's the medallion. What do you mean? The medallion is calling out to me. Please, Ike, take me to the medallion. Mist, talk to me. Wake up, please. Go, Ike, get her out of here. But... Leave everything to us. You have to take care of Mist now. See what's going on with the medallion. Okay, we're done. So the chapter it really is over. What are? Yeah. So so the, the, so so for this, I had I have to kill this a specific number of enemies. I guess so. Mist is gonna <laughs> corrupted mist. I mean, I wouldn't mind seeing that. What's this light? Uh, is it the medallion? Uh, Jacob, I don't think Miss is gonna be evil. She's gonna get possessed. Um, this is not the same as turning evil. No. Oh. She's collapsed too. Now I get it. Anybody who has the spirit of order within them is affected by this light. Captain Falcon, Queen Nyla, what are you two doing here? Grayson collapsed suddenly. Or at least Mr. Van Driesen is collapsed. I figured that I'd take him to a safe place. Raphael fell conscious, unconsciously as well. I thought I'd let him rest with Leanne. But I found out that she had collapsed too. And you think the medallion did this to them? Missed? That weird ass noise. I think I know what she's singing. She's probably singing to the freaking. She's singing the same song that that Mr. Van Driesen and Leanne sang in Path of Radiance to restore the forest. Yeah, that's what I thought. <laughs> when did this turn to anime? <laughs> The seal on the medallion is about to break. It can't be controlled anymore. My song won't work anymore. We're running out of time. What are you talking about? Call the Apostle. She must sing the Galder of Release. Hurry, before it's too late. Please, I, I can hear a voice. It's inside my head. The voice is telling me that we must not awaken the Dark God through war. A voice in your head? Mist, what's going? Mist, wake up! Ulki, do you hear me? Bring the Apostle here at once! <laughs> Are you sure about that? Mist is saying that she sh should sing the Galder of Release. She's saying that we should wake up the Dark God. So you will break anyways. If that's the case, then we should change. We should take a chance on your sister and do what she says. I agree with the Hot King. It's too late to calm down the Dark God back to sleep. It would take too long. Do you think we'll be safe if the Apostle wakes up the Dark God? 
Didn't we fight a major war to prevent that from happening a few years ago? I don't know. Are we safe now? But I always wonder why Heron, Queen L Lilina? Lilia. L Lilia. <laughs> Not Lilina, that's a different FE character. <laughs> okay. Passed down from the Calder of Release. She must have left in left it behind for a good reason. I'm willing to bet that on my life. Besides, it's the only choice for our survival. We won't know if it'll work if we try. All right, let's do it. <laughs> Lelina is in this game. Yeah, that's crazy. Oh, if only. Yeah, crazy. All right, Jacob. I brought the apostle with me. All right, Jacob. You're going to be shocked of what's going to happen after this scene. Oh, there's like the big reveal. Yep. And a little extra baggage. Oh, and Nutella. Can't forget about him. Raisin. Luan. I mean, Mr. Van Driesen. Now, now, Captain Falcon. I know you're angry, but we'll work it out when this is over. <laughs> Not a chance, Nutella. I hope you've said all your prayers and farewells. And you owe me for F-Zero GX. After I break every bone in your body, I'm going to rip your wings off and feed them to you before you get to die. Damn, bro is really out for blood in this game. Who the fuck hurt this man? <laughs> Captain Falcon, I must ask you for your patience. This man serves under my command. Take care, child. This is a Lagoose matter. You should see for yourself out of it very quickly. I'll explain later. Put aside your past quarrels for now. Not to repeat the King of Kildas, but we must have more pressing issues to attend to. Oh, and Captain Falcon, don't call me child ever again. Fine. You get to live for now, Nutella. Once this is done, you're a corpse! So, what would you have me do? I'll use all my powers at my disposal to help in this. Sing the Galdor of Elise for us. The song was that was passed down from the Heron Queen to my mother, then from my mother to Mist. But if I sing that Galdor before the medallion, it would awaken the Dark God. This is what my sister said. We must not awaken the Dark God with the Spirit of Chaos. We must use the Galdor of Elise instead. The seal will break if we just leave the medallion alone. Please, sing the song. Better than releasing the Dark God through war, is that it? Very well. I shall try. What's going on? Nothing's happening. It's not working, but why? Bird. A bird? Bird up! Yune. A medley won't work alone. Oh. Oh, what happened to my voice there? Wait. This is right in the middle of the enemy territory. <laughs> Captain Falcon's out for blood, bro. This man wants to throw hands in Riz of Valencia. Again, fake ass lost in all, tho all thoughts alone music. This music exists before that song. Soth, why are you here? Commander Ike and the Lagoose Kings, even the Apostle is here? I thought you'd be on the battlefield commanding the army. This just got really, really bad. Mist and the Herons collapsed because of that thing. True. Everybody's here now. 
I can hear the voice. Finally, we get to meet. I've been guided by this voice for so long. I finally found my purpose. Galdra consists of merely in lyrics. Without both in harmony, the songs have a mere fraction of their power. Man of Dawn, or Mean Dane. The only part I was taught was the melody. I do not know the lyrics. The words, they are passed down through the ages like a bloodline. Though the time may pass, their meaning is never lost. When I heard you sing the melody, the words came to me. I, I don't understand what you're going on about. There could be no way you could. So shut up and watch. That was pretty damn good. When I heard the melody, the lyrics felt as if they were poured out from deep within me. I know this song. I've known it since before I was born. I am... Oh shit! Bird. Bird lady. She's... Good morning to you, my goddess. What has happened? A thousand years has not been passed. Why have I awoken early? Indeed, my goddess. You have been asleep for 780 years. During that time, the world has kept its promise to you for a mere 200 years at best. Oh, she's not a bird? Okay. It was as you said. Neither the Lagoose nor Barak could resist the urge to fight, because they are too weak. Though there are 220 years left until the thousandth year, there is no longer any need to wait. Is that so? That is your analysis. Then I shall pass down my judgment. I will save them from myself. You see, Jacob, something bad is about to happen. Uh. Mist, how do you feel? Ike, you look so worried. What happened? Where am I anyway? The last I remember, I was on the battlefield. You don't remember? I had a horrible headache, and my stomach really hurt. And then suddenly, it all went away. Ugh. Mr. Van Dreesen? Captain Falcon, what is this place? Are you alright, Mr. Van Dreesen? Nutella, why are you here? You betrayed us again, you bastard. I had my reasons. I know you'll never forgive me, but I at least want you to hear me out. But it can wait. Captain Falcon and I will work out our problems first. You go ahead and sleep now, alright? Very well. I'm glad to hear that. Start talking before I rip your arms up, part. Whatever my reasons, you won't forgive me, I know that. But I'm asking you to put your feelings aside for now. We're both worried about the herons, right? You spineless piece of trash. You used that line on me before, remember? And look what my forgiveness did to my people. You live now because I choose for you to live. Nutella, once this mess gets sorted through, I'll be wearing your beak as a trophy. Now get out of my sight. Okay, I'm confused. Why? What did? What did Nutella do? <laughs> Am I supposed to know that he did what he did wrong? <laughs> Not sure yet. 
No? <laughs> no. Raphael and Leanne are still out cold. Will, there, will they be alright? There's no need to worry. They're just not used to the spirit of the chaos being so near. They'll wake up soon. Just imagine the Black Knight just comes into the room. Dern. Dern. No. <laughs> oh. That's 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 gonna ruin the moment. Oh. Wait, what Bikaya. the fuck? What the fuck happened to Makaya? Makaya, what happened to the Dark God? Is she awake? What do you mean? Why are her eyes red? I'm not Makaya. She's sleeping right now. What the fuck? What? What are you saying? If you're not Micaiah, then where is she? I wonder where Ashira is. We must hurry and make our judgment. Wait, what are you doing? No, you must not consult with me first. No, not like... Don't do this! I can't tell if Micaiah with red eyes is a baddie or scary. Oh shit, war! Micaiah is Yune. How are you feeling? It's weird, but it's weird. I feel great. Mm -hmm. Like a weight's been lifted from our shoulders. That's what he sounds like? The battlefield hasn't changed a bit. Yeah. And yet all the negative energy is gone. How could that be? No matter. So long as things on the battlefield go well. I'm still giving. I'm still giving him the skipper voice. <laughs> but what if good? We can end this now. <laughs> What's so funny? What if we could? Oh, I'll tell you after the cutscene. Okay. War is a simple thing. What comes after? That is hard. Oh, we have three the sides of the coin. That I have never known how to fight. Oh shit. Look what's about to happen. What is, you think it will rain. Even though these even though these cutscenes are compressed to hell, they're still great. It's baddie Makaya? Okay. What the fuck? Laser? Ah, my eyes. Miss, are you alright? Yes, I'm fine. What happened, though? What was that light? I don't know, but it's very quiet outside. Too quiet. Hope everyone's okay. After that explosion, no way. So, can you tell me what's going on out there? <laughs> Anyways, uh, the thing I was laughing at... The reason why Captain Falcon is so, like, rude to Nutella... <laughs> Zeppi said, Nutella made Captain Falcon rage in F-Zero GX. <laughs> okay, that makes sense. That's why he wants to rip his wings off. He lost to F-Zero <laughs> He lost in F-Zero GX. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. Yeah, and also, um, actually, oh yeah, the thing I was la I was also pointing out, uh, you know how Skipper said like war is a simple thing. Yeah. So now we have three games with funny war lines. We have Fallout Three, War Never Changes. We have okay. MGS Four, War Has Changed, and now we have War is a Simple Thing. <laughs> How many war quotes are we going to get? I don't know, but there you go, guys. You got uh, Fire Emblem Three Wars. Great. <laughs> Anyways, let's get back to the topic. Impossible. I can't hear anything. Either that light took my hearing, or there's nothing out there. What do you mean? There were thousands of troops. I'll go take a look. It's time. Oh, wait, that's, oh, that's you. <laughs> I'm so used to voicing Makaya. It's time. Everyone, let's go outside. B hey, Makaya, wait! 
Batty, Batty Kaya. Bad Kaya? <laughs> oh shit. Bike! What? In, what, in, what happened? What happened? There's statues. There's statues. What the fuck? That's literally what Ashira had did. She literally turned everybody into statues. Dude, it's like subspace. We literally end. We literally ended on a bitter I note. I know that you have strayed from your path, and I will punish your failure. A solid performance by Ike, by the way. Your success. I know. Order and chaos. A goddess divided. Judgment, hope, and an ancient covenant. All you can literally hear the remix of Ike's theme. To learn what Banger. To their world. Part four. Gods and men. Oh, there's the cool scene of Ike holding up the sword. We finally made it, Jacob. <laughs> Shara really finally... said, fuck it, let's be America and nuke the shit. We finally made it, Jacob. We made it to the final section of the game. Oh, well, our shit gets really good. All right, let's see a bit of part four then. Gods and men. First we had mice Jacob. and men, now we have gods and men. Jacob, this is... This is the final chapter. This is where... Th I mean, this is the final part. This is where things start to get real. Real shit. As far as I can see... As far as I can see and Oki can hear, it seems we're the only ones left. Strange. I guess only the strongest of, of us didn't wind up as, as statues. Anyone who was in the building with us was safe too, but everyone else was petrified. I'm not... There are qu quite a few more of you... ...flesh creatures left than I imagined. Flesh creatures? <laughs> That's literally what they called. That's good. Maybe that means we'll get... We'll stand a chance against her. Bakaya, are you feeling alright? I'm not Micaiah. How many times do I have to tell you that? If you're not Micaiah, then who are you? I'm Yune. Pleased to meet you. Oh, I see. I wasn't even joking. Yune is literally going to possess Micaiah. Well, thanks, Yune, for making Micaiah a baddie. <laughs> Yune, what did you do to Micaiah? Micaiah is here with me now. She knows that she will never save petrified ones without me. So, she let me use her body to talk to you. Alright, let me ask you about this, Yune. If you don't have a body of your own, what the heck are you? I've been asleep inside the medallion for a long, long time. Longer than any of you can ever imagine. But the Galder awoken. Woken me up. Laron's medallion? Are you the Dark God who was sealed inside it? Hmm. Dark God. Dark God. No. I'm sure I'm not the... I'm, I'm pretty sure I'm not one of those. I am neither holy nor base, neither an angel or devil. I am freedom, chaos, transformation, future, mystery. I am Yune. I don't care what you're called. Was it you who turned everyone into stone? 
No, that wasn't me. I haven't done much. Anything. I just woke up. So I don't have that kind of power just yet. <laughs> just yet? That, that was Ashira's doing. It was her judgment upon this world. Nonsense. Holy Ashira would never harm us. She protects us at all times and guides us towards the right path. Got it all wrong. <laughs> why did she, Why is Yune called her Meatling? Meatling. <laughs> what does Meatling mean? I don't know. Ashira is neither kind nor loving to the beings of this world. Neither is she holy nor base nor angel okay, or Okay, we get it. She is restriction, order, stability, past, certain, cer certain. Fire Emblem Heroes ass quote. Call Sonic -y little meatling now. <laughs> <laughs> all sonically meatling now. Oh, Sonic, you're my little meatling. Oh my god, why? <laughs> Restraint. She is Ashira. I don't understand. Why would the goddess Ashira want to destroy us? If anything is going to kill us all, shouldn't it be you, the dark god who's inside the medallion? You called me a dark god again. How... How would you like it if I called you a dark bag of organs? <laughs> I don't want to talk to you anymore. What? Instead, I'll talk to you. Yes. You're the one I'll talk to. I ship it. <laughs> Me? Why? I think I think Midkaya and Mist will get along well together. Yeah, because in some way they might be, they might be linked to one another. <laughs> they have more in common, that's for sure. <laughs> Yune being savage. Ashira has always hated me, but I like, but I like her. You've got some of her in you, so I'll talk to you. Oh, okay. So you're Yune. That's right. I'm Yune. Ashira is order. I am chaos. We are sisters, but opposite in all things. Oh, it's like the opposite of a twin. We're linked to one another. Though, when I sleep, Ashira sleeps. I sleep. I, when I wake, Ashira wakes. Oh, then you're a goddess? I'm so sorry. Please forgive my insolence. I've been talking down to you like you're a little kid. No, no, it's fine. Talk to me however you like. You don't have to stand on a cer ceremony, yep. right? Ceremony with me. Well, all right. If you insist. So you were sealed inside the medallion, but now you're inside Makaya. That's right. I, mean, I wouldn't mind being inside Makai if you know what I mean. Ho 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 ho! Why? Right, what do you mean you want to possess? Why you want to possess her? You know that, that works too. <laughs> and you, the goddess Ashera yeah. was the one who turned all the Barak and Lagoos into stone. Oh, are you here to tell us how to save them? Jacob, if you were to possess Makai, you could do a lot of things inside her body. Yo, I would have boobs. <laughs> yeah. And a VJ. This is not funny. <laughs> I know, Jacob. I know. This is a bad bit. <laughs> what do you mean a bad bit? <laughs> this is a bad bit. <laughs> what the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> Never mind. Jacob, you're such an idiot. <laughs> Wait, I get it. You're the one who spoke to me. You said, wake me with the gallery of release. Not with the spirit of war. Why does Zeppi say what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> okay, Zeppi, what's wrong? I'm just gonna wait for a response. Yes, I did. I'm so glad you understood. 
You're very clever. Of course, I was hoping... Please. Zephy says, why would you want to possess Micaiah? Oh yeah, you know what? That's not a good thing, actually, because then I'm going to be really fucking slow. Never mind, I take it back. I don't want to possess Micaiah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay, you know what? You have a fair point. Possessing Micaiah is going to be horrible because... She is very slow. Yeah, I'm gonna be I'm gonna be stuck walking all my life. I can't run. <laughs> I can't you double. Can't run. <laughs> you can't juggle. Yeah, and and I'm gonna I, I'm gonna die if someone even merely pokes me. And you're just gonna age slowly. Okay, well that's that's a benefit. But other than that, uh, nah, being Mikaya kind of sucks. <laughs> okay. But yeah, Zeppy. <laughs> Not many people just want to possess Micaiah. Yeah, that's why I said when I, I meant something different when I said I want to be inside Micaiah, but I won't specify what. Anyways, I'll leave it at well, that. Then, <laughs> well, Jacob, you have to be more specific of what you say. Nope, I won't. Nope, leaving it that. Anyways, on with the dialogue. <laughs> be specific, you idiot. No. Nope. <laughs> Pacific! Pacific! Oh. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Enough screwing around. Of course, I was hoping by sending you that message I would stop all of this from happening. What do you mean? Minus trying not to get cancelled. <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean? What? Why can't? Why would Jacob ever get canceled? I'm too amazing to get canceled. Jacob is too beautiful to get canceled. That too. <laughs> We're running out of time, so I'll explain this quickly. And again, beauty YouTubers got canceled, so never mind. Okay. Zeppi is Zeppi is saying, "Why are you dodging <laughs> the question?" <laughs> I mean, I have the now right Jacob, to. I have the right to remain silent. What if somebody says you don't have the right to remain silent and just force you to speak? Um, I mean, sure. Then I guess I'll say it. <laughs> long, long ago, your ancestors made a promise to Ashira. Long, long ago, in a galaxy far away. They promised they would start no wars among all the nations for. At least 1,000 years. That hmm. promise was broken, then Ashira would destroy the world and try again with a new one. Despite this promise, you, Bone Cages, kept fighting each other. Bone Cages? Hey, do you think, do you think on the thousandth year, they're gonna make a door that leads to a treasure? Zeppi said, Minus, <laughs> you're not in America, you can't plead the fifth. Fuck. <laughs> What the fuck does that even mean? <laughs> I don't even pay attention to laws, but... <laughs> I could sort of understand what plead the fifth means. I just heard it so many times from people on YouTube. Despite this promise, you... Oh yeah, I already said that. Eventually, war and conflict spread throughout the world. When Ashira woke up, she cast down her judgment upon those who failed to keep her promise. <laughs> Zeppi, but don't worry about it. <laughs> I still don't okay. understand. Why would it make a difference whether you were woken up by the Galder or by the Spirit of Chaos? How are you planning to stop a sheriff from passing down her judgment? I'm not talking to you. Oh, by all that's... Would you stop acting like a child? Please forgive my brother, Yune. We want you to save the people who are turned to stone. We need you to tell us how. It did matter that we woke you up with the Galder release, right? First of all, you should understand that because of our link. Waking me up in this... In the same as Ashira waking... Being woken up. Now, if Ashira had been awakened by the Spirit of Chaos... 
none of us would be standing oh, here. Oh, right that now. makes sense. By the terms of the promise, she was just supposed to destroy the world. No hesitation, no discussion. But if she was awakened by the Calder of release, she was supposed to consult me with me first. She wasn't supposed to pass down her judgment until she heard from me. Ashira went ahead and turned everyone into stone without asking me. That is so unfair. I'll show her, though. I'll turn them all back somehow. Problem is that I can't do this by myself. I need your help. Will you help me? So in other words, Yune didn't consent. Good to know. <laughs> of course we'll help. It's strange, but I trust you, Yune. And we all want to save the people who got turned into trophies. Yeah, basically, nobody gave Yune permission to do this. Yep, she didn't consent, and now everybody is a trophy, and now we gotta go stop Taboo. Yeah, we'll do whatever it takes. That's right, we'll allow nothing to stand in our way. We'll fight. It's all so confusing. We must do everything in our power to save the people. To be honest, I spent my life teaching that the goddess Ashera watches over and protects us. This is all a little hard to accept. You don't have to believe me. You could just let her destroy the world. I mean, Ashera literally is taboo. She turned everybody into statues, just like how taboo turned everybody into trophies. It's too easy to make that connection, I'm sorry. <laughs> That's true, I... No, I'll I do whatever it takes to save the people who return to trophies. I'll join the others in helping you. I really can't unsee that. <laughs> so what are you saying? Is that... So what you're saying is that all we have... All we have to play nice and work together? Just to forget all of this happened? So open your eyes and look around. There aren't that many people left to fix this mess. If you don't help, we can't do it. Besides, I would think saving the world is something we could all agree on. You're right, Commander. All of this is a result of our war. I guess there's not much of a reason to flag wave on either side. First thing we have to do, and petrify everyone. Well, I, uh, am actually kind of relieved. At least I don't have to worry about fighting you anymore. Yeah, that's good. And you and you also don't have to worry about play, getting played as and getting wrecked by the Grail mercenaries. <laughs> and, I know. And, and running away for two turns. It's a relief, Jacob. That's all I'm gonna say. I wasn't looking forward to that MU either. Bro, I, I really brought up the whole matchup thing. <laughs> it's settled then. How should we begin? I know. Let's divide the army into three teams. I'm pretty sure that Ashira is going to notice what we're up to. Dividing us up smart. It reduces the risk of everyone getting killed at once. We have to hurry. You can feel Ashira's building up power. It's all Jover if we get turned into statues too. Alright everyone, it's up to us. What's your name? I'm Ike. He said the thing! He said the thing! <laughs> What do you mean? Where he's like, I'm Ike. <laughs> yeah, so? Yes! Alright, Ike. You won't call me a dark god ever again, will you? Not if you don't like it. Can I call you Yune? I would like that. I guess I can forgive you then. Oh, I know. As a sign of my forgiveness, I'll make sure that you can get your destination safely. Your final destination? Can't I can't do it for everyone because it's a bit exhausting for me, but hold still and close your eyes. I'm ready. But if you close your eyes, you'll find that nothing <laughs> has quite <laughs> changed at all. <gasps> oh! Now, he's not going to be a hero anymore, Jacob. He's going to be a villain. Just kidding. No, he's, no, he's going to be a vanguard. Yo, look at this man! 
Yo, he's armed up. He's ready. He's finally ready to fight. How do you feel? Strong. Like I can take on anyone. You're very confident for a being that can die. Let's see. You go with this team. I'm going with you. I'm not leaving your, I mean, Micaiah's side. Fine. Micaiah mm -hmm. say, says that. Fine. Micaiah says that what she wants to. <laughs> no, Ike is not going to be the villain. <laughs> Let me talk to her. Not right now. You'll have plenty of time to talk on the road, all right? Hey, you're with this team over here. Damn it. <laughs> Damn it. Bad game design. Whoa, what the hell? All right, Jacob. This is the army that I might even... That I might have to switch for. Whoa. This is kind of wild. Are you going to, like, split them up evenly, or what? Yeah. So, like, you can have Heather on one team, you can have Mia on another team. Hmm. Those are big. On the green ones, I can't even switch teams. Okay. But however, there are there are others that I might even switch for. Hmm. Hmm. The Hawk Army gonna stay here. Yep. Oh look over here, Brahm is there. Yeah. I think okay. I honestly I don't really see any problems with these teams. Maybe like I'd say maybe, like, put one more good member on the Hawk army. Like, maybe, uh... Hmm. Maybe put, like... Hmm. I don't know. I mean, Jill is going to stay here, after all. You know what, maybe you can put, like, Mia on the Hawk army. Because I don't think the Hawk army has a good sword user. You know what? Sure. Yeah. Who should I replace? It doesn't really matter who you replace. I mean... The Grail Mercenaries is gonna be enough. <laughs> Make the Silver Army worse. <laughs> yeah. Now, we want, we want, we want Micaiah's team to actually be good. So having Nephany and Ileana and Laura and a lot of those members are really, really good. So, yeah, basically, yeah. Nephany is going to be the basically Nephany is going to be the strongest in this team. So, so sum it up: no, um, Nephany is going to carry the Silver Army, uh, Heather is going to carry the carry the Grail Army, and Brom is going to carry the Hawk Army. <laughs> Pretty much. All right, Jacob, this is it. There you go. We finally, we finally made it to the final battle. Yeah. Yeah. Oh shit, damn, look at this. Each team will take a different route, but your destination will be the same. It's the Tower of Guidance that stands in the middle of the land. You name Venyan. Go there at once. I hope to see you all there. And I'll be waiting. Waiting? Aren't you coming with us? I'll see you at the tower. <laughs> a bird? Basically, Yune just left Micaiah's body, so the bird is Yune. Well, yeah, obviously. Yune. Then she must be... Micaiah! Micaiah. Oh, hello, South. You're back. I'm so worried. Hey, if that bird was Yune, then where'd she go? I don't know where exactly, but she said she must go look for something. Leaving by herself, leaving us by ourselves. What was she thinking? At least we know what we have to do. Let's move out to the tower. May I have a moment before we leave? Prince Kurth has requested that I pass these out to the herons. 
These are sending stones, right? Correct. Fortunately for us, each Heron has been assigned to a different team. Thank God. That means we're always going to have Galder. King Captain Falcon, would you give this one to Prince Messer Van Driesen? Ideal. We can communicate with with the other team using stones. Good idea. Oh, great. So we have walkie-talkies now. <laughs> Queen Nyla, please give this one to Prince Raphael. I wouldn't call them walkie-talkies since they're more like cell phones. A walkie-talkie sounds more fun, though. Why? Because, you know, it's just cool. Walkie-talkie, you know? Maybe you should buy your own walkie-talkie, then. Mm, nah. Walkie-talkies are too old. I know. I just thought they were cool. Well, they used to be. Is, <laughs> is this a greeting? He literally sent me an image of Yunaka saying, is this a greeting? And he also sent me some sauce. Is this a Yunaka with Booba? Yeah, it's Yunaka. Sure is. I like that. I like what I'm seeing. A Wooga. Me too. Hot damn. And the last one is for Princess Luan. He's on my team. Give it to her. Bird lady. Luan is the real bird lady. Alright, we are ready to go. See you to the tower. Yeah, see you at the tower. Hopefully. Ike. Since we're on different teams, I need you to tell you something important before we go. It's General Zelgis. Next time you see him, Ike, use caution. He's your enemy. What do you mean? He's the one. He's the Black Knight. What? Zelgis is the Black Knight. I became certain of it when he crossed the river. It can't be. I wasn't going to tell you until I had hard proof, but looks like we're out of time. Sorry I didn't tell you before. General Zelgis is the one who killed my father? I doubt that Zelgis has turned to stone. Be careful, like You might run into him. Good luck to you. Uh, he well, th 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 thanks for the warning. Zelgis, the Black Knight. Well, I mean, it's obvious that we already know since Path of Radiance. I mean, I already know because I kind of got spoiled <laughs> a bit. Oh yeah? Since when? Cause Smash I, Ultimate? Yeah, and also because I read the wiki. I see. Because I was looking for images of Black Knight, and then it's like, oh, but his name is Zelgis. And I'm like, oh, well, shit. I guess I know that now. <laughs> <laughs> so, well, oops. It's not, I, don't really, I don't really mind too much, though. Ashura, the goddess I know. Has a weekend. But it will be the last time that we will see Zelgis. But you should also oh, know that Zelgis also has a backstory. Oh, interesting. You're, you're probably aware of what race uh, Zelgis is. Uh, nope. Okay, good. It's also a surprise of what, of what race he is in. Micaiah is joined by her constant companion, Soth. General Skrineer also accompanies her, along with Nassama and Princess Leanne. Yunaka and the Papaya. <laughs> rounds out the group, traveling with her chief wow, look at all these cool people we got. Micaiah's company decides on a sudden I have a funny gift sets out for of what's going to for the sounds of to the three teams <laughs> messaging each other. All right. It's as though they have stepped into a vast and desolate monument. You should probably show a minus of what I'm talking about. Sure. All right. Prologue Chaos Named. Chaos Named. Or maybe it's Chaos Named. <laughs> well, this is a great start, isn't it? We've been going for four hours, by the way. Oh, God, it's fucking Lou Albano. This is, gonna be a this is gonna be the longest episode ever. We're at four hours. You think well, maybe you, my, you think well, maybe I should split unit, this up? Well, that's because my units kept dying, Jacob. Oh, and fair enough. this is one, and this is actually one of the longest openings we've ever seen. Now, question: Do you think I should split this up into two episodes or just make it one really long episode? 
Just one really long episode, just in case it's not confusing. All right. Oh yeah, Zeppi just send you something. All right. <laughs> that, <laughs> that's gonna happen oh great that's pretty <laughs> funny anyways here's little bono bless the servants of the goddess i bring some dire news paisanos the dark the dark god has awakened and made its wrath to manifest in stones all of us were turned into hard rock by its evil it's a stone yes. luigi it's a stone, Luigi! A stone, Luigi! <laughs> and we stand here today, made by the flesh again by the power of the goddess. And hopefully the goddess will grant us season three! <laughs> Why is that possible? Because we are the chosen ones. Go forth, disciple of the order ones. Deliver her divine judgment upon the dark god and those who worshipped it. Go forth, Deke Entertainment. Make season three. <laughs> Make season three of the Super Mario Bros. Super Show. With the Mario Brothers and plumbing is our game. All right, everyone. Let's spend the night in this town. Be sure to get some rest. <laughs> and prepare tomorrow. <laughs> the break, the Discord being shitty, Laura's pettiness and art made it longer. <laughs> yeah. I don't like the air here. It's a little too pristine, too clean. Yeah, what what he's talking about, Laura, Laura's pettiness. She literally puts people <laughs> he, to sleep. She just keeps to keep going. Like night, 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 night. Go sleep. She, lit she literally wasted my friggin' sleep staff. <laughs> wow. I was about to use it, but she wasted all of it. Great. Anyways, Thanks, Laura. Jacob. Anyway, Jacob, just read the dialogue. I did already. Okay, it's clean, but not Mister Clean. Yeah. I feel like I'm befouling it just by standing here. Nothing, Luann. Just talking to myself. <laughs> Would you like to join us for dinner? Oh, oh shit. Uh, I've prepared enough for three. Ah, <sighs> Neluchi, hey, I've already told you. Don't call me a nestling. I'm not the child you used to take care of. Just look after Luann. I don't need babysitting anymore. And here comes Skipper. Ah, Nutella, you traitor. You turned on your own kind. You're right, of course. Go ahead and tear me apart. I deserve it. Do you think I won't? I'll make you pay for suffering of my comrades. Do not bully Nutella. Holy shit, she's using the power of tea posing. Boy, this worm has brought ruin on the Lagoo's alliance. But Nutella suffers too, very, very much. He... Luan, I wish you would stop looking into my soul. It's very rude of you. Nutella's suffering? He hasn't suffered nearly enough yet. I can fix that, though. Please do not harm my young master. Oh, take me instead. Get out of my way, old crow, or you'll die like your master. Wait, Skipper. Neiluchi. Luan, get out of the way now. Oh, blast it all. You run? You're both a traitor and a coward, Nutella. Sorry, but I changed my mind. No, someone else wants my head even more than you do. If I let you kill me, he might never find an outlet for all of his anger. Oh, he's talking about Captain Falcon. Ah, you have a point. Captain Falcon has the greater right to kill. I'll let him punish your treachery. Standing down? I'm a little surprised. Are you tiring of your role as the hothead lion prince, Skipper? Don't push me, Raven King. Uh, is he gone? Oh, goodness. Oh, from the look in his eyes, I thought he would eat us all. Well, 
well, that's, well, off, that's off to a wild start. Okay, that... let's please save the preparations for next episode. <laughs> well, I kind of want to do this right now. A Rex Bolt? Come on, oh. you have you have all the time in the world to do it next episode. Wait, I want to see the Rex Bolt first. Okay. Micaiah has it. Let Okay, let's just see the freaking Rex Bolt. SS, that's for Eliana then. That that's literally the highest uh freaking magic rank you'll ever see. Fuck I'll yeah. give I'll give this to Ileana. We don't oh yeah there he is. I saw the worry. Do we have Ileana on our team? Nutella really made everyone rage quit in F Zero GX. <laughs> they were playing like four player or something. They they all he, 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 they all just lost. Mm. Or no, he, he beat their ass at everyone. She hasn't leveled up she hasn't leveled up her thunder just yet, but she's she really will. close. She's gonna yeah. she, like three or four more uses. But I'm not gonna waste my freaking Rex Bolt just yet. I have yeah. to bless it. Hmm. I wanna see what experience. Oh my god! 26,000 experience? That is a lot of experience, I will say this much. Alright, well, I can level up Laura. Arm scroll? Is there really an arm scroll? Apparently. Yay, Laura is now a saint! She... She is a saint. Now, let's see... Now, let me go shopping. No, there is... None, apparently. <laughs> Gamble for Micaiah's speed. <laughs> gamble for Micaiah's speed? Yeah. Okay. I'll, I'll, I'll at least gamble for Micaiah's speed, just in case. Here goes nothing, Jacob. Dink. Nope, it's still no. Micaiah still does not like getting speed, even after getting possessed. Thorin even got- I mean, Soph got speed. Why did I say Sorin? Yeah, that's definitely Sorin. No, yeah, def definitely. Wait, wait, wait. Level up Nephany. <laughs> oh, never mind. <laughs> yeah, she has reach. Uh, I was hoping. I was hoping she could get more magic. I could. Think. Nope. Why is Micaiah so fucking awful? I'll at least give her strength. Think. What do you know? She levels up strength. Nope. Why can't she level up speed? That fucking bitch. <laughs> why why doesn't she want to level up speed? Maybe there maybe there's a clear, simple explanation as to why she can't level up speed. Are you gonna level up Sigrin or are you not gonna use her? Yeah, I'm still gonna use her anyways. Well she's got SS in lances. So does So does freaking. Uh... <laughs> Zebby says uh, it's funny when you get pissed. I know I'm angry. I have a Snickers. Nope. Fuck you, Micaiah. <laughs> Do you have any idea how angry I am? Yeah, that's why you gotta have a Snickers. Please give me speed. No, need... no, no. <laughs> she refuses. Why is Micaiah such a bitch? Hmm. 
There you go. Finally! Okay, give me some more. And drink some more, and drink some more. Nope. <laughs> Back to shitty level ups again. Yeah, I'm so happy that she gets shitty level ups. I guess you could say she's living with determination. Oh, I am sure she's living with determination, all right. Dink. Nope. Yeah, dink. Dink, 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 dink. Dink. You know, the depressing thing is that friggin' South is about to get more speed. He's stealing all of Micaiah's speed level ups. Dink. Okay. Out of all of the friggin'... You know, like, like no, maybe she doesn't. Maybe, maybe, maybe freaking no. speed, speed isn't her best attire. But maybe, maybe luck is her best. Luck, she maxed out luck. <laughs> what the fuck? Think. Hey, she maxed out defense. Nice two speed. <laughs> Think. He maxed out speed before she did. There you go. Think. Hey, she maxed out defense again. She maxed out defense. Yep. And, and res. You know what? I give up. She'll, she'll max out. Friggin think. Hey, there you go. Alright, last level up for mid Kaya. Think. Okay. She got speed on the last level. She has 19 speed. That's how much speed she's ending the game with. Unless you can find a speed wing or something. There's no speed wing, Jacob. I'm sorry what? to tell you. Really? There's, wing? There, there's no speed wings in, in part four? No. Sadly not. No, no. You know, Jacob, I'm I'm just going to do this. At least she'll have a fighting chance. Good on you, Tannen. Seraph Knight. She's also Seraph Knight. Good on her. It just makes me baffled as to why she can't even level up. Friggin' speed. Yeah, her curse is even worse than Soren's. Okay, for the last few level ups, I guess I'll. Who's. Who's noteworthy? Yeah. You know what? Sure. I don't care Yay. anymore. Oh, she got the same thing in each level up. <laughs> but you know what? That's fine. She at least gets more... She's got 29 speed. That's pretty damn good. That's... You see, Jacob? She... Laura gets more speed. I'm not joking. She, she literally got a need for speed. And, and you want to know what's even funnier? What? She's close to maxing out her speed. <laughs> yep. And her ma and her magic is in a long way because she maxes out magic in forty. So she's better than Makaya? <laughs> well actually not forty. I guess it could be either twenty eight I mean thirty eight or thirty nine. Yeah, something like that. Hold up, let me just check. Her max <laughs> Her freaking maximum amount of magic is, huh, 38. I'm, I'm surprised. You, you want to know what's going to surprise me? What? What happens if she maxes out defense before res? I don't know. And yes, Micaiah did get more speed. She, caps at, she capped at 19 speed. <laughs> She could have she could have capped 20 if I'm gonna be honest, Jacob. But nope, Midkaya is slow as balls. 
Yeah. But I she did, she did ma she did max out defense and res though, so that's good. Yeah, but the problem is that she's still frail, Jacob. Yep. Her defense her defense is really low. Your and health is low. And you want to know what's worse, Jacob? What? Her maximum stat for the next class is going to be 33 speed. <laughs> That's crazy. Yeah, I'm not... And what's even worse is that she's not going to level up freaking speed. When does she get... When does she promote? She probably promotes in the tower. When's that? Endgame. So she doesn't get to promote until endgame, which means you barely get any time to give her more speed. Exactly. That's dumb. So she's not gonna max out her speed regardless. I really wanted to max... Jacob, I just really wanted to max out her speed, but... Or at least 20 speed, but she can't even... She can't even reach to a certain speed that I really want her to be in. Well, here's my reaction to that information. I know, Jacob. <laughs> I know. Yeah, that's, this is disappointing, bro. What the fuck? You see why I called her one of the worst units in the game? <laughs> well, one of the worst protagonists, that's for sure. Well, yeah, one of the worst protagonists. Mm -hmm. But all I can say is that she's not as bad as Roy, oh. and even Lynn. Poor Roy. Apparently, apparently Roy is a horrible unit. You want to know why? Why? Because, let me tell you something, Jacob. Roy literally promotes at the end of chapter 21. Yeah, and how many chapters are there? 25. So he only gets like he only gets like five chapters to do shit. Basically, he promotes very late. Great, thanks, Binding Blade. Basically, you have to give him a lot of strength and speed. Wow, sounds like ass. But, oh, trust me. And the worst part is that he can't even fight most of the time. Wow. If he, the only time that he will promote is if he gets his Binding Blade. No wonder he Which, no wonder he became a Marth clone. What's even worse is that the fr the freaking Binding Blade is also late and promotes in the same time. Boo. Anyways, yeah, I, I'm, anyways, I'm tired as balls. I want to go to bed. <laughs> yeah, me too. I'm freaking tired. Uh, this, uh, this is this is the long. This will probably be the longest episode ever. Well, it might be. I'm not sure if it will stay as the longest episode ever. I sure hope so, because I don't want to do anything longer than four hours. I made an exception. I made an exception because I really wanted to get to the end of part three today, and the first chapter we did was so short, and I was not expecting that last one to take three fucking hours. So, You yeah. haven't seen nothing, Jacob, because the end games are going to be even longer. Well, then we'll just do one end game per ep per stream, then, <laughs> if that's the case. Probably because, let me tell you this, Jacob, the, most of the endgames are going to be scary as shit. Yeah, so we'll have to dedicate an episode to those, probably. But anyways, Excellent. guys, thanks for watching Radiant Dawn. Hope y'all enjoyed the especially long stream. Make sure to like there's, and subscribe to me on YouTube and Twitch. Yeah, and, there's going to be 11 the final part, so... And uh, I guess we'll start part four next week, so... Yeah. Probably next week. What are you gonna do? Um, like I'm gonna be doing a bunch of stuff this week, so I probably won't have time for more Radiant Dawn. Plus, we already played twice this week, so I think I've had my Radiant Dawn fix for the week. And Jacob, we literally played Radiant Dawn one one time last week. Nah, I think uh, we can take a small break before we start up part four, anyways. Yeah, I guess you have a point right there. And then we can get right into it. So. We can probably finish Radiant Dawn, like, by the middle of August, I think. And then we can start Garen Quest. Maybe around when September starts, who knows. I'm, I'm just making an estimate, I'm not too sure. Anyways, I'm gonna end this stream. I'm gonna end this recording at exactly 4.20, so... I'll see you guys then, take care, and eat your vegetables.